Kenapa BGM yang ini ya? <laughs> I don't know. Apa sih BGM yang? Anyway, hi. Uh, dengerin disini. Singer songwriter Oscar Nugrahan from Nigeria. My name is Reza Fandana. Welcome back to me, JRPG. We ride for our GM of Nigeria. You know, run some games for my nerdy life reference. Anyway, uh, huh? welcome huh? back huh? to huh? Nocturne huh? of the Heaven. This is the. Eighth episode. Mm-hmm. How's everyone doing? Mm-hmm. <laughs> uh, I am shaking in my boots. Pretty good, considering <laughs> I'm dead. I'm. I'm cold sweating. I'm booting in my snack. There's a snack in my boots. My booty is shaking. I'm oh. Uh, oh. <laughs> What? <laughs> uh? Full, full of question mark. Anyway, uh, uh, <laughs> tadi yang bilang kayak ini Rai sama Nara mana terawih katanya. <laughs> 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 bilang bilang. Uh, anyway, um, Nara uh, can't, can't uh, join us today. Uh, send some uh, what is it prayers to Nara, please. And also Rai Galilei will uh, will join us um later uh around 9 p.m. Rai Rai Galilei will return. Rai Galilei will return. Yes, exactly. And yeah. Whether you like it This or will not. be yeah. This will be for for people um session because after Rai after Rai comes back Frederick I mean Lila <laughs> need act- actually need needs to leave early. <laughs> Ini kan namanya apa pergantian shift teman-teman. Oh god, well there you go. Is the stream Teamwork. dead? What? Is the stream dead? Wait. I don't, I don't know. know. I'm opening your I'm watching stream. it right now. Uh, okay, there we go. Yes. Um the channel is. Uh, anyway. <laughs> 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 Say something. 
I don't know, guys. Did he say something? Uh, uh, he just laughed. He just laughed. Did, did he say something? I didn't hear anything. Please, say something. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't hear anything. Terima kasih diucapkan kepada Porn VPN. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> I think he just got some screws loose, you know. Anyway, mm. uh, before we start, let's introduce everyone as always. Uh, the the one who plays the best girl, even though she's technically not. Hionella Theora, please introduce yourself and your Excuse character. Excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me. Hey, you're not you're not you okay? <laughs> of course I'm not. <laughs> See? Of course I'm not. See, that's what I meant. Anyway, introduce yourself and your character, please. Mm, my name's Yona. <laughs> I play spy. That's all. <laughs> <laughs> She's mad, everyone. <laughs> Anyway, the actual best girl who plays a not be- not the best girl, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> Takara Jiman, please introduce yourself and your character. <laughs> oh my god. Hi. Hi everyone, Taka here. Surrounded by no one. Uh, <laughs> playing Kesi today, I guess. <laughs> Taka Taka Rajiman of Sunset Barbecue playing a TRPG game with us. He'd be like, "Yeah, I'm here with nobodies." Yeah, I am a nobody. Oh, I'm there's surrounded no by no one. About. We have nobodies for him. Yeah, there are nobodies apparently. It's not about dia nggak di kiri kanan gua nggak ada orang. Oh. Yeah, that's, around here. that's what okay, he meant. Uh, he he, oh, gitu. he meant no one, no one is worthy enough to be beside him. Uh, <laughs> we are not worth. We are not worth his attention, people. The freaking accusations, my freaking god. <laughs> anyway, next up, the Ashley Johnson of Niji RPG. Love <laughs> <laughs> please introduce yourself and your character. Hello, good evening, everyone. Apparently tonight I'm not Layla Stromeria anymore, but I'm Ashley Johnson, and tonight I'm going to play as Frederick Alfonsina Hexenmeister. No laughing. I'm trying to be professional here. Hi. Everyone. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh God. <laughs> <laughs> sorry. <laughs> and last but not least. Please, Zia Cornelia. Hello. Please introduce what's yourself pa- and your character. Oh, what, what's poppin? Hello, I'm Zia Cornelia. Uh, what's poppin? What's, what's I, today I'll be playing Kunako then. Please send her prayers. I will. <laughs> Pray for no, 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 no. The I problem is like, pray. will will the prayers even work? I don't think so. We don't know. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> oh God, I need to stop doing that to you guys. <laughs> what? It's doing okay. What? We're used to it. Do doing what? what exactly? Doing you don't what? know. Please. What? Don't say you... that. <laughs> What do you the mean we don't, don't know? know? The closer I get to you, I am approaching you. <laughs> anyway, no, I don't know anything. Uh, we just, we just, you know, the, it's the the start of the second half of our uh, campaign. Uh, episode seven was quite uh, a blast. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, yeah, that's the blessing. That's the blessing. Thank you so much for blessing our session today. Thank Fiona, you. like is it, always. Wait, wait, is it is it please a blast? Don't. Or is it a blast? <laughs> that's so I nice. don't mean it literally. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so that wasn't a blasting. That actually was a blasting. Okay, yeah. Yeah, that's why. That, that's why Zaya. That's why Zaya asked, "What's popping?" Yeah, what is popping? Like someone no, said, apparently. What <laughs> what's popping? Well, <laughs> oh I don't God. know how to tell you. <laughs> oh, my patience. Oh, it looks like someone's <laughs> eager to play. Anyway, 
<laughs> Is everyone ready? <laughs> yeah. I'm cold sweating, just so you know. Sure. <laughs> Nocturne of the Heaven, episode 8. Come, sweet death. It's starting shortly for uh, lifers and viewers alike. Good luck. And have fun. Before we go to the first scene that is with Yuki Murasae, Murata Keshi, and um, Onoko Hani, I want everyone, as always, to re-roll their spirit pool. Wait, can't find my mouse. You can't find your mouse? Mouse? Oh shit, a rat. Remy? Oh, there we go. You know, I spent like an hour looking for train sfx and i forgot mm? to put it in to Aww. the game <laughs> maybe you should put it in now <laughs> take like, your time uh no 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 the, the file was gone the file is gone what no. No, no, i forgot where to put it it will what? take some time so i'll just what? not do it <clears throat> Sai and Keshi. Hi. Hi, the two of you. Doshio daro. The last time you know the, the last we left off in um the previous session of Nocturne of the Heaven. The well, the three of you with Kohani was and who is unfortunately not here the three of you reached this um the station the main Tsukimori city station the one that connects well the whole Tsukimori city and also um the railway route towards the Hexenmeister headquarters and practically everything in the whole island you board the train that arrived around midnight one that looks really old just looks like a, an old commuter line and all three of you got in Only to meet someone that's familiar to y'all as the train moves on without well with his left hand gone left arm gone but fortunately his all right Tachibana Satoru was there, noticing your arrival into the train, as he said. You're also boarding the train, Sai? And he just fell to the ground, to the floor of that cart. What the fuck? Conscious. He's just tired. Size immediately gonna like ditch Keshi <laughs> and run towards him <laughs> and run towards him. <clears throat> mm -hmm. And she's immediately going to like uh, 
uh like grab his head I mean, I mean like not aggressively but just check if he's conscious or not <laughs> you can do it aggressively i guess no <laughs> no i didn't mean aggressively i mean he's fucking panicking oh, shit. sure you, you you ran to him and then um tried to check up on him um he is fine he's all right he's alive he's breathing um his left arm is weirdly enough not bleeding what? well the the wound itself is is feel, uh, looked like it it burned immediately so it cauterized all the uh, uh. what is it the, the 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 open wound and the the flesh so uh, there's no um active bleeding at all coming from that wound he looks fine but well, barely alive, you could say. You... You... Goro... Um, um, Sai is kind of like... You, you, can, you, you can tell that she's visibly trembling and panicking. Mm-hmm. And it took her a few seconds, but after like doing that for a while, she kind of sit straights back up and she, what's the thing that you do? She kind of slaps both of her cheek with her hands uh-huh. to like ground herself, you know? Uh-huh. And then after that, she takes like one deep inhale. And then, <sighs> okay, your life. Um, is it is 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 it still bleeding? Fortunately, it's not. Um, how uh, how how are you feeling? Any um, any concussion or uh, other bruises? You know, at this point, we're all used to it already. <sighs> Satoru, you know, I just... I'm I just... fine. You... <laughs> she makes like a very pointed look at his missing left arm. <laughs> you... <sighs> You're clearly far from fine. Quite. I I met our uncle, and I guess I just lent him a hand. <laughs> a smile <laughs> weakly. At at his joke, <clears throat> Sai just immediately just like deflates. <laughs> <laughs> it's like it's like you took away half her soul with her, you know. It's just whoop, you know. It's just gone, and. She doesn't want to look uh, in his eye, so she lowers her gaze to the ground, mm -hmm. to her lap specifically, and you can see that she's gripping her skirt to the point that her knuckles are turning white. Uh huh. Why didn't you? Why didn't you bring me with you? He gets up and said, well, if I bring you with me, then could have lost more than just an arm. But I could have helped. I could have, I could have prevented this. She says nothing, but um, she says nothing and makes no sound. But uh, you can see like some water where tears dropping into her hand. Sure. But she makes a point not <clears throat> to show it. Mm -hmm. Hmm. 
In any case, he looks at you. Then he looks at Kohane and Keshi. As you say, Diego Toshi no Sera, and one of yours. Um, the one with black hair, the, the fluffy black hair. Toshi no Sera's friend, I. I it's hard for me to remember names, but yeah, it's that girl. Did she wear pink framed glasses? Yeah, that's the one. Mm. <sighs> and they have Kurako-chan. I see. <sighs> what? What happened, Satoru? Like, who who else did you see when you... When you met Goro? Only him, actually. And... Another person. White hair, glasses. White hair? Glasses? Yeah, it's, I'm not exactly sure. I, I don't think he's human. Uh, uh, uh. He's what? here as I'm... well. Oh, you know that person? He sometimes go to my shops, yes. <clears throat> Are you talking oh. about Amano Jaku? Yep. <sighs> right. Well, I sure don't know what they're planning, but whatever it is, it's definitely at the end of the station, at the end of this train ride. And he sat down on one of the the seat. You know, the, the seats are, you know, the, as the usual thing that they're just mm. creating like a, a line at the, at the side facing the center. I guess I sat there and put his um, sword to the side and lean his head back to the window of the train. So is going to stand up and she stayed still for a moment as if she's, you know, trying to mentally process everything that's going on right now. Mm -hmm. And then after like another long heaving sigh, uh, she sits down next to Satoru, although she made a point not to sit <laughs> next to his missing arm. <laughs> <laughs> Probably because, probably because she doesn't really want to see it right now. So she's, I, I guess she's sitting on his, uh, right. Uh huh. And she's still, she's still looking down. Just unsure of everything. Also, hi, Rai. Hi, Rai. Hi, Rai. Return of the Heaven. Return of the Heaven. Nocturne of the Heaven. To be cursed or to be ascended. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> and I feel like I, I, I feel like she would like glance at Satoru as if to say something but decides not to. And just yeah, returns to her sitting, sadly, position. Sure. So what are we all actually planning? Especially you, sir. 
His, he looks at the Ukeshi. He, you, you can see, you know, Satori is smiling. He smiles all the time, really. Even 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 though um, Sai was was crying her eyes out, do you know that uh, Satori still tried his best to smile? But this time, his like behind his mouth, you can you, you can feel like that his you know he's a little bit suspicious of you. Uh, I'm just going to take this train ride. Maybe do some business after this. I don't know. Business been slow. Economy is falling. Well, tell me about it. <laughs> just, just not exactly sure how how to respond to that. But is it? But seems like everything is just business for you, huh? Depends on how you see things. <sighs> Satoru, I... Um... A few things happened before we arrived here, and um... Yeah, she kinda... she kinda <laughs> gives him a careful glance. Um... Danish is dead. He looks at you. I see. <laughs> I'm, s I'm sorry. It's not like you're the one who killed him. No, but... We could have prevented it. I could have prevented it. <laughs> who killed him? <sighs> who did it? Clover did. Sai, so you're not exactly the type to joke around in this kind of situation. Who did it? And at this point, Sai finally turns her head and just looks at him fully. And you can see that she's crying. There's just, you know, her eyes are starting to redden and tears are flowing down, even though maybe wordlessly. And she just looks at him without saying anything. Oh, shit. Oh, my dear, did it, huh? <sighs> I guess... I guess whatever this Amano Jaku is doing, I guess, I guess he's part of it now. <sighs> he looks at Kohani, who is, well, just there. Let's just say that she's being silent through the whole thing. Hmm. Satoru looks down and... Oh. Where did he go? Where did Clover go? Um, I... I... I don't know. I... I think I was kind of passed out um she looks to keshi did you see where he went murata-san do mm, dm do i know he he ride the train again yeah you definitely did see it 
Okay. I was down. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> so I was he... down. <laughs> he did something similar to us, riding a train. A flying he... one? Yes, the flying ones just like, uh, just like the child cartoon we see during the Sunday morning sessions on TV, if you still have them now. Then we are going to meet him. Well, that's great. Means we didn't ride the wrong train, isn't it? Nikki Minasan. I. I suppose so. Although that probably means that. That Goro will be there as well. Well, shit. Satoru, are you sure you. It's not too late to... It's not too late to turn back around if you want. I... I can fight, I can... Whatever it is you need to deal with, whatever it is the reason that you're riding this train, I... I... I can... I can take your place, I can... I can do it for you. Satoru looks at you and says, I need to finish this, Sai. Five years ago, I took the blame, thinking that it, it will keep all of you safe. Turns out I was wrong. Five years later and Goro is back. If you ask me if I'm sure about this, I'm not. How could I be? I just did the greatest mistake in my life. Leaving both you and Kai alone, without any protection. But I need to finish this. I need to finish him. This isn't... This isn't your burden alone. You said it yourself. You already took the blame for what happened five years ago. Why? <sighs> Whatever this is, you... Why do you want to bear all of this alone? You have me. You have Kai. The cycle needs to end somewhere. And if you die doing it? Well, that, then that's the end of the cycle, Sai. Si. It's just how it is. Um, she doesn't say anything, but, you know, she, uh, does that, what, that, that, like, that, that position you do when you have a stomachache, when you're, like, sitting, but you're hugging yourself, and you're, like, bent, like, bent over. Sure. <laughs> 
she's she's like that, but but she's not really saying anything. The question is, he looks at you, Keshi. Satoru stands up and draw his sword and just swiftly swing it towards your neck. Satoru? But it stopped like around like five centimeters from it. What are you doing? I did not say any words. Which side are you on? Murata Keshi. Is this how it... How, why is everyone asking these questions? Not you, not the cat, not the... the what is his name? Amonojaku? Is it weird that people just... Do things at the extent of... Because their daily life has been but Like, you just want to go to do things you like, you want to do things that you think you're... Think it's a daily needs. And then people just like keeps asking you which side are you on, which side are you on. I'm just a civilian, sir. I'm just a civilian who thinks that... Humans and... Whatever astral being that exists here can just do their own shit. And people and if people or other beings keeps asking me which side are you on? I don't think there's even a side to pick on. This is a war, sir. Mm-hmm. And then? And a powerful third party like you is the most dangerous one. Say what you want. Sorry. Um... Sai is yes, going to Yukimura like... Yes, san what are you going to say? Um... Sai is going to like stand up and just like uh, put one hand on Satoru's shoulder and just like I Satoru I think I I don't know which side Murata-san is on right now but for now I I think we can trust him enough at least your choice Uh, Keshi. Yes. I wanted to please roll a will check. <laughs> what? <laughs> 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 oh boy! Is boy, there any option other than will? Uh, no. Uh, well, I'm if you if you have it. any ability to give bonus to um connect maneuver, then sure. But yeah, but it's will check. Nah, I'm <laughs> Satoru doesn't look convinced at all, but whatever Sai said definitely help calm him down a little bit. You can see that he start he just from the rea his reaction alone. He sounded like he could understand your reasonings, the things that you just say it. And just that alone stopped him from swinging that sword further and just take it back. Uh, 
Just making sure. And Sae gives Murata Keshi like an apologetic look. <laughs> She's she she's trying to like she's trying to like hold off Satoru, you know the whole like tahan gue bang tahan gue <laughs> like she's <laughs> she's trying to do that you know just like um, how about we all just um sit back down then yeah I was about to say it but that your friend here just pointed the sword into me um where's the rice I'm sorry Murata-san. Um, you don't need to. You didn't, didn't do anything. I, I know. But um, and she looks back at Satoru. But um, I, I don't know much about Murata-san, but he he helped me a lot during you know all the battles. Yeah, you should check on my Yelp reviews, dude. <laughs> But that's exactly the problem, isn't it? The Yelp reviews? No, just the fact that no one really knows who you are. Well, isn't that nice? Then we can always keep an eye on him, right? Yeah, sure, sure. Uh, y y y you don't mind, right, Murata-san? So I it's mean, like, so like... It's just like begging and pleading right now just so with, the, with this cool like, guy. He's like, guys, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> full on, full on caretaker mode right now. Just like, I mean, sure, <laughs> yes. Like my whole shop is filled with CCTVs, the ramen shop that tastes awful. I'm sorry, the soba shop that tastes awful in front of the school has CCTV right through, uh, right into the directions of my shop. Surveillance is like every day, bro. Yes. Um, exactly. Me say, uh, okay, he's saying that while looking at, like, the severe arm parts. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Sai, no. Sai just, like, gri grips, Sai just grips on Satoru, you know, she, she, she just grabs him at this point. <laughs> nah, the case he said, said, nah, I'm joking. I couldn't, uh, oh, wait, how to say it? Uh... Uh, there's no need for problems, I guess. Let's just wait for the train to arrive at its destination, isn't it, people? Gentlemen? Gentlemen, sorry. Fine. <laughs> Again, I'm just making sure. He... He then just crouched down and struggles to put the, the sword back into the sheath. You know, he only has one hand after all. Um... <laughs> And yeah, at, at, the, at that moment, suddenly, the three of you can feel um, this, uh, this, you know, familiar um, pressure that happens when you went through a spiritual barrier. And <laughs> what you see outside is no longer Tsukimori. It's just this field but most of, of your what? most of the scenery that you saw is just a vivid red sky the vivid red sky just fills most of the scenery that you're seeing right now that in itself alongside the double moon that is floating in the sky this contrast this fast like grass and flower field below it, it extends like far beyond the horizon through basically this place that you're going through in the train you don't see exactly anything around you would expect some ruins or just this void of darkness or something but this whole realm just felt like, you know, the, um, just a rural area around a mountain or something. Far beyond everything you see, a small station 
besides a few buildings that looks like just this small town in the middle of nowhere. And slowly, your train just stops in a dark station. The door opens. The first thing that you see beyond the open door is a really old looking wall. And on it is a sign that says Kisaragi Station. But aside from that, you see one. You see a bench. You know, the usual bench that you would expect to exist in a station. And someone is already sitting there on a bench. Directly in front of the open door as if she knew which door would open. She is just... This human lady, probably in her mid-40s or early 50s. Wearing just a simple like, nurse uniform. And have this blank stare in her eyes. You see this lady. Where is she? She shows a courteous smile. Doesn't feel kind at all. It just felt like, you know, a professional one. Then she walked to the three of you. Four, including Satoru, I guess. As if she just can't all three of you, she took a pause for a brief second. And then she looked at you, Muratakeshi. She said, Are your expected guest for the tea party, Mr. Murata? If that is your name. It is my name. And is it has to to do with the the envelopes? I surely <laughs> hope that <laughs> he you hasn't didn't read it <laughs> to bring it. Uh yes, I bring it with me. I haven't opened it. See, it's still sealed. Ah I see that you're the type of a person who it's quite spontaneous. Well, but but then here I am. My name is Yoshikawa Hikari. You, you're Kohane. Kohane told us, right? <laughs> Just rechecking. She 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 spilled the tea on the way to the station, right? I think <laughs> yeah. I think so. Okay, which okay. means that we, which means that we know. Mm hmm. You're. Wait, you're Yoshikawa Hikari. Seems like you know me, Miss. Are. Um, correct me if I'm wrong, but aren't you Amadeus's, Amadeus Clover's wife? It's been a while since the last time I heard that name. Oh, you haven't met him for a long time? No, not since I was trapped here. Interesting word. 
She smiled. I will probably need to talk to you about that more later, but the Crimson Chamber is waiting for all of you. Please follow me. Oh, um, very well done. Then she walked away. And scene. Uh. <laughs> I'm scared. <laughs> I'm enjoying the train. <laughs> I want to go back to the train. <laughs> As we go to the trio, the Tuny trio. Um, I'm not Tuny. <laughs> Are you not tuny there? Okay, sure. A little bit. <laughs> As we start that next scene with Sh- shut, shut up! You don't control <laughs> me. <laughs> hey! Oh, yeah! Oh, 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 Come on! Oh, oh, there you go. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> I swear, this music. <laughs> <laughs> we go back <laughs> to <laughs> the old man Godwin and the high schoolers the group of other old men and the the black robed old man with a gun and that shooter with white hair Everyone is old. <laughs> what a group of My people. people. I'd say a group. What a group of people. <laughs> honestly, honestly, for real, for real, no cap. As this happens, I'm a, uh, the, uh, um, I'm gonna just shrugs. Well, well, well. That's a funny turn of event. Uh, uh, as everyone, if you guys remember, what happened last session was. <laughs> Frederick's betrayal? <laughs> Top 10 anime betrayal? Is it betrayal? Is Frederick's this betrayal? Is this? We well, don't know. I don't know, Brokhan. You don't know? <laughs> you don't know, DM. Shut up! <laughs> you don't, you don't control, control me? me? <laughs> oh, Lord. I swear to God, every time someone said it, I will, say, I will drink myself. <laughs> what you will drink yourself? You'll drink. No, you'll get broken up. Yourself. And then um, no, no, I will liquid. I will liquidify my. I liquefy myself and then drink myself after that. You <laughs> sure? And then okay. um, and then the what is it? The 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 guy, uh, Johan Faust, he again summoned like a lot of like a, a lot of. The shadow sh- soldiers, like, they go around him with his shadows. Most of them look like Johan himself. But, you know, a little bit more fit, at least. Some of them look, well, exactly like you when you were younger, um, Godwin. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> um, God- and Godwin then, uh, fascinating, is fascinated looking ta- at his younger self. Yeah, Tachibana Guru is immediately, like, draw, a so- uh, draw-, draw his sword and... Oh, I do not have time for this. And then he he, he just take a stance while while um Amadeus like grab his his head. He's like, Godwin, you are beside Amadeus Clover. Hmm. And it, it, like and he looks like he's in extreme pain. And as if like he he lost a little bit of control of himself. And then suddenly like the the serpent like. Uh, the serpent heads like start like sprout out from his back, <laughs> and like it all uh, sprout out. And yeah, the three of you looking at everyone who's fi- who is fighting, who is, who is probably going to fight right now. They well, it looks like it's going to be dangerous if you caught up in it. What are you going to do, the three of you? Well, of course, I believe Kurako is having a mental breakdown. <laughs> Kurako <laughs> is currently decommissioned, yes. Uh, and she's still looking her identity. Uh, <laughs> I mean, she can still use... 
she can still use uh, things, her skills, quote unquote, if it's unlocked. I'm uh-huh. pretty sure there's like some kind of lock function on her right now with Avana Chaku. <laughs> <laughs> so, what do you want to do? Uh, Godwin would be staying near Krako. Uh, uh-huh. Also looking at Frederick and sees if she is in a position. Is she surrounded? She's alone, right? She's a, yes. well. She's she's already, you know, far from Johan, but she's also far from you guys. Uh, and I don't have any powers. So. I mean, I mean, Kurako can use the snap, <laughs> snap thing. Snap, snap. Uh, but she is um, breaking down. <laughs> <Remember>? <laughs> I guess. I guess. Uh, how's my twin doing up there? <laughs> so good, well, Kurako, nice of you to ask. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> well, not, like well, as, fine, again, as you look at the the huge, like the massive Tori gate, you see like floating mid air is well, you technically. Uh, well, someone that looks like you, and this is just in the uh, in the state of um, just being inactive, like just like just this limp body is floating there, but you can feel like you know the the familiar um, spiritual energy coming from there, yeah. Oh, oh yeah, so, so, so uh, body is not like limp and dead, but it has spiritual energy. Yes. So it's like an empty shell, but full of spiritual energy. You I don't know. You, I, you we don't know, know bro. <laughs> we gotta check. We gotta check, bro. Can I? Can, well, can I? Oh, wait, wait. I forgot something. Uh, do I roll my spiritual? Uh, you, you haven't. You have to. Please roll it. Okay, I roll everything. Okay. Uh, DM, can I actually do something with identify that you know the floating buddy <laughs> <laughs> of you know the other Kurako? You know what? I will let you do that. Please roll um, intellect check. Identify. Wait, yeah, but, uh, Kurakutu then. Kurakutu. Sure, of course Kurakutu, you can identify her yeah. out. She's gonna be uh, like her own body. Yeah, but, um, uh, Frederick will just stay silent, smile a little bit, just um, secretly doing the identify things. Okay, uh, what did I need to roll again? Will, 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 uh, check intellect, again? intellect. Yes, okay. Kurako, uh, do you want to influence that? A... Ah... Uh, um, I, I think I can. Uh, let me just. Re- I mean, I can, but it's not gonna change much. My dice is very low, so I'm not gonna do anything. Sure. Then um, 15 for Kurako and 19 for um, Frederick. Um, Godwin, what were you going to do before you roll your spirit pool? Spirit roll? Uh, intellect check on the. Uh, on the. on the. on the clones. Wait, you're like. Johan? Yeah, uh, intellect check on the on the Johan. You want to check Johan? Uh, um, uh, well, it's not intellect check. Roll, identify, 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 identify. Sure, yeah. roll your intellect check. But if you have your strengths, Behold. like yeah, sure. <laughs> you immediately, you immediately <laughs> succeed because well, there you go. Um, uh, I change I, one to five. Yep. I will. Um. Okay. First of all, I for the identify. Um. For everyone, I will not refill any stats yet, but uh, because well, technically there's none. <laughs> no, <laughs> there is a stat, but mm-hmm. I will I will describe you what's actually w- what they are actually. So um, for uh, Godwin, you're looking at this Johan Foss, and this one, like you you cloned yourself many times, you know, to create a lot of your assistance. <laughs> but but I wanted too much of a job, but, but one of this well but but the main one is Johan Faust like the 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 better ones I believe and this mm. guy is literally him you saw him when like this guy is the one who followed you around this guy was the one who well who was there during your arrest <laughs> um and who, during your arrest and then actually you know gone missing during the battle you're that, that like it's it's the same the very same one but this guy have like his um you know body a little bit enhanced by the shadow thing um and then 
And uh, mind you, the last time you saw him was before you enacted that spirit spiritual barrier, if you remember. Yeah. Yeah, it's because like the moment you enacted that spirit barrier, he didn't enter. Ah. So yeah, that, that was the last time you saw him. Um, and this is actually the first time you saw him in this form. But through like you know because because you own this power, <laughs> this is <laughs> your power. So oh, you God. know very well that whatever is enhancing his body right now and like all the shroud, like the shadow, the 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 co- the, the, code, the 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 cape and everything, it's exactly like the stuff that you use to enhance yourself. It's the same principle. Like he has, he have, he have like exactly the same power that you do. Oh, oh no! no. <laughs> but oh, no. unfortunately, <laughs> he has a gun. <laughs> <laughs> it's just the difference. It's just the difference. You have a gun. You have a gun. No, no, you brought a gun to a fist uh-uh. fight. Uh uh-uh. uh. So a, yeah, that's a, basically that's Johan Faust. Johan Faust. MK2 or something like all the shadow clones around him are well shadow clones and all um, while Kurako and Frederick is, is did, did Lila say that she's she's going somewhere? Yeah, <laughs> did Lila yeah, yeah, sorry, BMP, okay, she's back, she's back. Oh, okay. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna lock my door, I'm gonna yeah. let her out Take first her out. and then lock the door, okay? Uh, give me a second! Yes, goodbye, it's okay. Kiara, goodbye! Uh, God, Goodbye, God looks bit. at <laughs> look, looks at looks at what what is called balam right now, and actually cracks a small sweat for the first time in his life. <laughs> <laughs> he knows how dangerous Carol, he is. Only Kara wanted to go out, and like I still hear. So um, I'm sorry if there's sure. gonna be another noise from Kiara. So don't worry. Um, for Kurako and Frederick. Um, the two of you are trying to identify what the hell that, Kur- that floating Kurako is. The, the, the only thing that you know fr- from looking at it from afar is that it's exactly Kurako. But like, not in the same exact state, you know? Like the body is the mm-hmm. same Kurako, but like this one probably didn't go, you know, full on, you know, the, didn't go through multiple, um, what is it? Sleepless night, just going through Pathfinder, or <laughs> oh, you know, this I'll one didn't get any haircut, so like the hair is just <laughs> extremely long, you know, <laughs> like that. You know? But 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 from the body itself, you can see like it's it's literally Kurako. It's floating. It's the body is limp, but it doesn't look exactly like a dead body. Oh. Um, it's hard for you guys to see because Kurako is pale, in general anyway. <laughs> Um, <laughs> it's just like a body without yes. a soul. It looks like that. Um, it's Kurako, also, but healthy you, and raw. All of the two of you can definitely feel this immense spiritual energy from her, from this body. But like, what you guys didn't realize that it it, it didn't realize before, and or just found out right now the moment you focus your um, gaze there is that that spiritual energy actually extend. To anywhere, to every direction, that it probably reach like every single spot in the realm that you are in right now. Mm-hmm. But also at the same time, it felt extremely similar to um, mm-hmm. what you felt sometimes from Hoshino Sera. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. That kind of like divine slash angel power or anything, and like at mm-hmm. that time. What everyone doesn't realize, like in that log, in that that log, is suddenly like this. the The whole premise is filled, start is starting to fill uh, fill with fog, with mist, and like <laughs> it, it's uh, it's starting to be uh, to get really hard to see anything. Oh, even God. even mm-hmm. Tachibana Guru and um, Amadeus Clover are, are, are confused, but Amadeus Jaku looks extremely <laughs> pissed. And at that time, the two of you felt like this gaze coming from the floating Kurako body. And it, it opened its eyes. 
So and it's that an time, it, not even a she. Okay. Time stops. Oh, so what is all? But is it still flowing for us? No. Does the time still flow for the both of us? Probably not. You don't know yet. <laughs> you don't. Know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> Um, the time suddenly stops for both of you, but you guys can see each other, you know, the, but but you can still see each other like moving. Everyone else mm -hmm. is like frozen. At the same time, oh. the at the same time, like the, the bright, like the, the vivid red sky is gone. It changed to like a little bit of bluish, um, a bluish, like crimson colored as if like it's it's around like sunset. And the body is gone. The floating body is gone. And then what the two of you see is basically just this bench in the middle of that empty space under the Tori gate. And on it, sitting a lady with black hair that looks like Kurako, but grown out of a little bit S few years older but it's definitely kurako no picture <laughs> it's kurako god damn it <laughs> no, what is... the picture is this <laughs> oh my god. nah that's oh, a joke <laughs> Oh, that's the uh, that's the old Kurako, but definitely yeah, that's her. <laughs> Let's go, baby. Alternate universe, Kurako. Alternate universe. You see, universe. on that bench, the 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 girl then turn around. She she's still sitting there, but she she's looking at you, Kurako. I'm and then you can me. hear her voice, even though she said it really, really quietly. She said. It's been too long since the last time you used my power, isn't it, Kurako? What? Who, who, who are you? <laughs> she... Still looking calm, but... Putting a playful, annoyed face, she just looks at you. You don't recognize you don't recognize me? Really? We've been beside each other for a few years. Uh, I I see you're uh, you're Angelica, aren't you? I just I don't know. You say to recognize you, but I don't recognize anything. Uh, apparently my whole life is a lie. Did, did you know that? I'm seeing all of this, right, Dian? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> she said... Mine too. Come here, the two of you. And then she basically just pat the part of the bench that is empty. So, um, Frederick takes the steps forward. She smiles and says, Let's go, kura She's calling for us. Uh, Kuroko is gonna hold Fred's hand and walk together to the other Kuroko. <laughs> the other Kuroko. While walking there, um, Frederick lets out um, these words, but like really, really quietly. I'm sorry. What? <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Let's go. Hello, other Kuraku. The moment you guys reach that bench and sit down beside her, she then just turned her gaze to the the changing sky and the sun and this. And the water is slowly flowing through the ground. The two of you must have too many questions about this. I... Well? I do, but... I 
guess, well, first of all, basically, I'm, I'm not really alive, I guess. Is that right? <laughs> no, who say that? <laughs> Are you being uh, kind, lady? Well, I'm not living... I'm not... I mean, Amano Jogu said that I'm supposed to return this life back to you, which means I'm, I'm gonna die. I I'm gonna die, right? At this point, Frederick just squeezed um, Kurako's hand and says, You're very much alive. But I'm going to... I'm no matter what to. he said, no matter what he said, you are alive. Kurako. So at this point, oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> so uh, okay. I just wanted to say that Frederick is kind of um, trembling for a bit because she already saw all the things under underground that her brother showed her earlier. Well, she tried to give her strongest expression just like always because she always hides her fear or her expression um but she just cannot deny it anymore after she saw a lot of kurako inside that gloss um tube uh, Glass. What tabu? What? I forgot. I forgot. It's a tube. It's right. It's right. Okay. It's, it's right. It's a tank. It's a tank. Technically, it's not a tank. Like a okay, glass tanks. Um, Angelica <laughs> looks at you, Kurako, and say, "That's far from right. I got it all wrong, Kurako." Yes, your father came to me 16 years ago to lend you my power for you to be alive. But what I gave you is pretty much yours now. And what you gave me is something priceless. I... I gave you... I gave you something? Of course. I've been trapped here for thousands and thousands of years and because your father created that pact with me 16 years ago I get to connect back to that world and be you know and then she she posed a little bit <laughs> the the usual pose for um you know magical star Angelica <laughs> Uh, Kuroko giggles, but also cringes at herself a little bit. <laughs> See? <laughs> um, one question, lady? Yeah. Um, I mean, Miss Angelica? So... Um, just a little question for me. Uh, do you know... What's... Your purpose? Um, can you tell us what's your purpose of... You know, are you some kind of a deity or something? And why will you... What is the reason behind you agreeing to the pact with, you know, her father? Hmm... I guess it's the humans. She... Looks... Far, you can see like this immense sadness in her eyes. Well, thousands of years ago, back then, I I lived in Sukimori. It was nice. The people and those. Beings that you call Ramitama and Mononoke are all living together.
But one day they all started to despise me. And they start to fight each other. That, that was horrible. Oh, and wait, why? How, how did what? you end it up? Yeah, um, well, how did you end up and why? What's happening right now? Why, 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 why are all those weird dangerous people gathered in one place just to just to i don't know what they're doing i guess they're trying to revive you seal you i don't know amanajak was one of them who tried to protect me thousands of years ago but he was against the very thing that I tried to do. I sealed myself and therefore separated the worlds between the normal humans and those who are spiritually connected to things and thus created this realm. The Kisaragi Void. I just can't imagine, like, how long are you trapped in here? It must have been horrible. Not so much. Are you a racist kind of lady? Because I just feel like you were... Don't you ever feel lonely? Of course I do. And that's why I'm thankful to your father. She looks at Kurako. Because of what your father did, I didn't feel that lonely anymore. But I, I mean, everything I do, I just, you know, I just kind of s stayed in my room and, well, the internet and, and stuff, but, but, but I, I never did anything. Well, isn't the internet interesting? <laughs> it it I is. I, I mean, I mean, it is. And, well, well, I, I, I hate it sometimes, but I, I also love it because you know people people scare me and and well interacting through the internet kind of um helped to ease the um <laughs> anxiousness a, a little bit you you get me right <laughs> Fred, oh um, you are cute and then uh, um frederick just um snuggle her hat to uh, kurako <laughs> you're cute <laughs> I, I don't I get know. It. I don't get I understand. It. I understand um people could be scary sometimes, but once you know how to make them do things for you <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm what? just joking. Well <laughs> I'm just joking. That that's scary, that's scary. <laughs> oh well um Frederick holds both of Angelica's hand and Kurako's hand. And then, like, they connect, um, she connects them together. And uh, so, what should we say about this meeting? I, Is this what you call a destined meeting? I mean, I, you finally I, meet someone who's, who's always lived inside of body, right? Yes, and I, I mean, it's, it's been just a few moments, but I've been thinking about it, um, Angelica, with, with this life you lent me, what do you want me to do? She looks at you, Kurako, and say it. 
Amano Jaco brought you here. So you give me full all of your life to me. But I want but I, what I want to do is the complete opposite of it. The complete opposite? Yeah. If you ask me what do I want you to do? Then, what do you want to do, Kurako? I... I don't know what I want to do, really. I... I don't have grand plans. I... I spend all my time... Well, browsing the internet, as you know, and... Well, ever since... I got your powers, well, I've been going out more and I meet these crazy people and despite what everybody said about, about my father, he, my father is, he, I know he cares about me, I just, I just really, really, I just want to live normally. Um, another question? I s I'm so uh, I mean, I'm sorry to suddenly, you know, uh, disrupt your, um, uh, your serious conversation, but I mean, thinking about how you stop the time and let both of us meet you, you're a pretty powerful being, Miss Angelica. And are you saying that you're willing to lend your powers to Kuracha? She looks at you and she's like, This whole realm is mine. So of course I can stop time in it. So and I didn't you? choose the three of you. It's The three of you are just out of my control. The th three? Yes. The other one is inside the three. He means... The... Inside the train? There's somebody Kura coming for us? Kura-chan, she means... Huh? Oh, she means... Serata? Sera, yeah. Is that her name? Hoshino mm. Sera? Yeah. Better just not. Mm. That's a beautiful one. Oh, so our name are not beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> just joking. Kurako. Y yeah. I can she, she fear looks... our connection and just let you live your normal life. And everything will <gasps> be fine. But are you sure you want to do this now? Now? What will happen to Hoshino Sera? The angel. Will be this the exact same thing that will that happened to me. So if you let Amanojaku do his plan. So, oh, you mean... She's the... You already know what's going to happen to her. Because you said, um, same thing will happen... The same thing that happened to you will happen to her, so... <laughs> it's a bad thing, huh? believe that my brother actually knows me. Um... Sorry, but... Amano Jaku... said that... he wanted to keep Serachan safe, but... I don't know. What do you feel? For his own good, I believe. 
she 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 just she looks at the the setting sun and the serene sky and the the empty realm that the two of you are in. Oh DM. Oh, by the way, at this point, um, uh, Frederick's state is actually she's just looking down, you know, like um, sure. the dark face on her forehead, and her eyes are like wide, opens wide, and she just stays silent. Sure. All the things she thinks about, all the things that happen, everything else, just floating around inside her head. Sadness, anger, she doesn't know what is it anymore. So just fall silent. Sure. As Angelica continues, without looking at you, Kurako and Frederick, she say, this is Amano Jaku's definition of safety. <laughs> This is what he you meant. Mean, this, this nothingness, this, this whole place. Yeah. I feel sorry for him. <laughs> I see. Yeah. So, um, this is what, this is what's going to happen to Sirachan if, if we don't keep her safe, right? Yes. I believe... I believe you know what... What should we do, Kurajan? For our <laughs> precious friend, isn't it? Well... She is, but... Is it... Is it really okay... For me... To... To live on this borrowed life just... A little longer with this power you gave me i just i just i just want to keep the people closest to me safe that's that's all it's not a borrowed life she um frederick yelled and and then she said something again quietly only to herself because if you if you said so that means mine is too But no one hears that. Kurako... You didn't... borrow... my life. I borrowed yours. And, um... Did you, uh... Did you like what you saw? Yeah. Then it's it's okay for me to to continue on like this, like like nothing happened. All I ask of you right now is to make sure you keep your friends safe. This one, and that other one. <laughs> she pointed at, at Frederick. <laughs> I... I will... I mean, they are my... Well, I wouldn't say my only friends. I think I have other friends. I, I have friends on the internet. But I... I, I like Furechan, and I, I also like Seratan. So if, if that's possible, then... With, you know, with all in my power, I would, I would do my best. Frederick suddenly hugs, um, Kurako from behind, and says, "You know what? You are my very first friend that I ever had. Without my brother, set it up for me." Your what? Your what said? Said what? What? Your br what? <laughs> what? Um, never mind. She just smiles and then she looks at Angelica. So, shall we go protect our friend then? 
Well, it's not like I have any power at all because apparently the power that I got is set up by my own brother and then he's not here. And she just rambling away. But, but if, if you, Angelica, if you, if you could unlock everybody's power, then at least, at least we we could keep ourselves safe, run away, or fight back. Is that is that possible? For now, I want. The two of you to run away. Right? Run away. And then she looks and then and then she looks to the side to nothingness and then suddenly like from that nothingness you know from from that empty space like appear <laughs> your headmaster. Oh <laughs> What the hell? What the hell? What the hell? <laughs> What the hell? Come on, every Suzu. Suddenly but that means up. she's good. That means she's good. <laughs> you're, 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 you're uh, the headmaster. Come on, every Suzu. Suddenly showed up. She's, she, 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 as if like she teleported there, and like um, she's kneeling now towards um Angelica, Your Highness. <laughs> Angelica just said, Suzu. Keep the girls safe. Bring them to um, the others. Um, Mom, Mom, Miss Hella, Headmaster, it's a Headmaster, it's a cheese, a fry for a chance. It's just a good Wait. Get ring her composure. Good afternoon, or maybe, uh, well, maybe should I should say, good evening, Mrs. Principal. Um, what's, what's the occasion? <laughs> At least she just uh, felt super awkward because she doesn't understand why would her principal be, be here. <laughs> she grins. There's a lot of things that you do not understand, I see. She smiles wide, but like, we, uh, as, as she smiles widely, both of you can see the fangs. Oh! She has like, unusual long fangs. Oh my god, she's actual, she's an actual vampire, what the freak? The fanfics are real! The fanfics? Are... Is that the fanfic? <laughs> Wait, is there a fan theory about that, that she's a vampire? <laughs> Everybody kept on saying, oh, she's a vampire, she doesn't look old, you know? Really? Oh my god, yeah, but she is, yeah. <laughs> okay. okay, so, um, at this point, Frederick holds, um, holds Kurako's hand, like, really tight and trembles. But, act and she looks down, but not, but actually not because she's scared. But she just slowly speaks to Kurako, like, Kurachan, is this... Real? Then she looks up at Kuroko and her blinking eyes are back again. <gasps> Our principal is a vampire. I mean, that's pretty cool, but I guess after meeting a goddess, I don't think if I can feel the same about vampires anymore. <laughs> pretty cool, right? No, huh? occult club, calm down. <laughs> Frederick just, you know, just falls down, you know, like the ha with the happy face, like, ah! Now that the two of you know, I expect you to keep this a secret from everyone else. <laughs> Unless some people want to be expelled. Oh, uh, Frederick, uh, uh, Frederick I makes a gesture no. of zipping her mouth. Hmm? Wait, when we wake up, are we gonna be in that? In that place again with the um the the, the old men and the, their... you all will be fine with me, said Suzu. But and then she looks at Angelica. But are you sure this is what you want, Your Highness? Angelica just said, "Of course. Why wouldn't I want this?" Wait, Angelica. Then what? right away, Angelica. What, what would happen 
What will happen if if I die? What will happen to you? You don't need to know. As far as you're concerned, I don't exist. <laughs> I will do my best to protect your vessel then, Miss Angelica. Then within the, the, the stop time, Suzu just walked to the train and grabbed Hoshino Sera, who's still unconscious, by the way. <laughs> for the longest time, she was sleeping for the past, like, hours. <laughs> it's been hours since... It's been hours since you guys, you know, were in the school. Um... And then, uh... Suju... Su Suju... Suju... <laughs> Carrying <laughs> sorry, Sarah. Sorry, sorry, sorry. She stopped in front of, <laughs> of you and then. Let's go then. Follow me. And Susie walks. And Jessica just said, Come on, let's go. Red looks at Kurako and. Well, shall we hold, hand hold hands again? Uh, Kurako holds. Fure-chan's hand as they walk together towards Suzu's, but at the very last second, Kurako looked back to Angelica and she whispered, well, she mumbled, as Kurako does, something along the lines of, if, if I can, if I can set you free, then I... That's all. Sure. It's the only one who looks back. As you walk. I want you to roll luck check. Could I go? Ah. Me? Yes. Either, either luck check or intellect check. It's okay. It's, oh, uh, it's up to you. Intellect. Intellect, please. Yang gede, yang gede. <laughs> Paling gede nih. Nah, mantap lumayan lah. Hehehe. <laughs> cukup lah ya, Mas DM. Cukup lah. Kayaknya enggak sih, tapi enggak apa-apa. This is my best. <laughs> she is staring at you with the kindest smile ever. Sometimes well, you will, you know, at, at, that, at that point you will, you do understand why, well, she's the angel. But the further away you get from that spot, you start to see the the lights around the the water, the bench, everything that felt serene around that area start to become start to become darker and darker. And the shape of Angelica herself. Starts to look a little bit more and more resembling a dead buddy. So you get them like you, you can see like it, it rods here and there and slowly just disappear as you get further away from that place. Oh no! Wait, Kurapu can see this! Yeah, that's the last thing you see. Like no matter no matter how much you want to walk back, if you even do, if you even do, you you for some reason you can't move your body. No. I, just I think what I was gonna cry. At that scene is <laughs> fleeting. That holds Kurak Chan even tighter. Meanwhile, Meanwhile, no more like right immediately after. <laughs> <laughs> Me and the boys. <laughs> Just guys being dudes. <laughs> so, hey. how you doing? <laughs> How's your back? Sad Godwin, you made yourself clear before that you kept your distance as close as possible to Kurako. 
but like as if within the bling of an eye, within the bling of an eye, both Frederick and Krakow are gone. Boom. With the <laughs> mist that slowly le- goes up, and, <laughs> and then Amadeus looks at the thing that's happening. And is like, what in the hell? Uh, and Goro is saying, it's her, isn't it? I'm on the job. Uh, uh, wait. The only reason why I'm, I'm here is to... He points at the nothing. Uh-huh. <laughs> <sighs> to nothing. And, <laughs> and um, Johan is also extremely confused by what's happening. Ah, uh, well... He, 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 he looks at, um, you, Godwin, because you're the closest one to Kurako. Uh, and he's like, Godwin. where did she go? <laughs> I don't know. Angelica! She was right here! <laughs> I, uh, he looks towards Angelica, like, in the sky. Is it still there? Ooh, good question. <laughs> <laughs> that thing is gone, man. The one that's floating mid-air is gone. <laughs> is that Angelica? The... Look up! They're gone! How many said they are? No shit! Sir, I am equally confused. I'm just stating the obvious because I'm panicking. Alright? Uh, what was I hearing? This is. This is pointless! And then you, you're just like, ah, I'm not gonna waste my life fighting trash like all of you! Especially you, old man! He looks at you, Godwin. <laughs> Old man? I mean, I guess I am your father, but still. <laughs> there's no way to talk to your creator, Faust. Shut up. <laughs> You're not my you. dad. Uh, hearing that... <laughs> hearing that, God, Godwin rubs like his chest, like his hand, like, oh. Uh, but then, but then he stares. Uh, he stares at Faust again in like in like disbelief. <laughs> like because he is uh, he he Technical. took time to perfect himself. <laughs> yeah. Like he took time to perfect you. <laughs> like, Technically, I can't believe. I can't believe you, you say that to me. I took time perfecting your body. Based on myself, and you treat me like this. I wish that you were never born. Then you should have not created me. And, uh, and that Tachibana Goro was like, this is pointless. And he, he, he starts to walk, like, walk cl- uh, closer to, uh, was it, towards, um, Johan Foss. So, well, Amadeus just raised his hand. No, it's not. Ex- it's, it's not our first priority right now. Unless he still wants to fight. Are you going to be the old man's lapdog? Or are you just going to run away, Faustus? Just remember. I'll be back. <laughs> Stop with that of me gun. <laughs> he disappeared with the shadow. <laughs> he said the thing. <laughs> he said the thing. <laughs> it's like I, I need to stop making movie references. <laughs> you need to, please. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, being a parent is hard. <laughs> what the? 
God, I'm just saying, tell me about it. <laughs> what the? <laughs> <laughs> the two most horrible parents in the world. Nobody there is a good dad. What the fuck are you on about? <laughs> I'm just. <laughs> I'm just. You're all terrible. Like a... So what now, I'm on a jacku. Well, depends. If both of you can track the Crimson Chamber, I can tell you where they are. Probably. But more importantly, what are we going to do from now on? Dr. Dubois? I'm Please do. Exactly. Stop calling me by my real name. It really makes me uncomfortable. Well, as your wishes. I guess I'm just going to try to find two of the girls and if if I'm feeling a little bit not in the mood I'm just going to go back and do my research. He smiles. The thing that you will accomplish after this will determine whether or not I call you Godwin or Rennie. But more importantly, are you really not interested in ultimate power? I mean... Oh! I do. Mr. Godwin, what I offer you is not something that you are going through with that Alexander Hexenmeister, no. Equal partnership. Freedom. You'll be able to do whatever you want to do. Uh, Godwin gives, gives like this uh, tonking emoji, like, hmm. I like your offer. I might think about it for now, if you don't mind. Well, of course, I do mind, but. I believe. Getting Hoshino Serais. Something that both will do good for both of us. That is true. But I really do hate the quote on quote partnership. I understand the equal standing part because it was there at first but then another guy came into the party and then ruins everything what what makes you think that it's not going to happen again and how can I trust you Mr. Amano Jaku? that's the point You do not need to trust me. You just need to know that this will benefit us both in the long run. What do you want me to do? Find the angel? Find the angel and bring her to me. Then I will help you get your freedom using her power. And in well, the new world, he raised his hand. You are free to do as many research as you want. Uh, God with looks upwards? <laughs> mm hmm. 
What did he see? Upwards? To, to the sky? Yeah, to the sky. It's because I'm on a dark point stop. Nothing? Well, we're what waiting. <laughs> we're waiting. What's the new world you're talking about? Oh, God. <laughs> Win? Speaking about looking upward, <laughs> none of you have done it <laughs> in this realm. Uh, you look up. I have. Right. Yeah. Well, it's just it's just Kisaragi, um, the sky of Kisaragi void. Um, the red one, the two moons, and everything. But I will let you roll. Intellect check. Uh, the power. I have the power. I'm sorry. Uh, <laughs> Wait, do you still even have any spirit dies for that? I have a lot of spirit that oh, we haven't God. fought yet. <laughs> sure, why not? Using the four and change the dice five, four to five. Sure. You look up. You look up and... You just stare at the 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 sky, the, again the double moons and everything, and then you focus your gaze. You focus. You, you stare at the the two celestial. Um, what is it? Thingy? What? Is it? What? What? The the That's moons the moon? basically. The moon. <laughs> oh my god! You stare at the moons and. Taking two minutes of just looking at it. Suddenly you see both moons are staring back at there. The what? And they actually do. S for some reason, each one of the moon have each one eye. There's this oh, huge no. eye across the, the moon itself as it opens and stares back at there. And you start to see faintly spiritual energy around both moons, creating like this shape of like wings. One of the moon is not exactly familiar to you, but the other one looks exactly like the one that's staring into um, Tsukimori for the past weeks. So yeah, you see that. Then I'm gonna uh, check this out. Well? I'll just go get the girl. He turns his back towards the train. Does this still work? Probably. He continues to walk towards the train. Then off you go. Mr. Clover, Mr. Tachibana, I hope that two of you will play well with our new member. Thank you for coming to the membership. <laughs> I don't expect much. Hey. But I surely need to see some results from our equal partnership. And Amanda Jack walks away. Amadeus looks at you, Godwin, and say, Well, shall we then? Oh, but got there. I can do this alone, but if you want to accompany me, then. That's fine too. Whatever. And see. Woo! Hey, welcome to the club, I guess, Godwin. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> I'm, 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 I'm part of the. 
I'm a part of the Amano Jaku membership. Let's <laughs> go. No, 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 no. It's yeah. called the Horrible Dads Union. It's, it's the Horrible Dads. Apa, apa, apa the... tuh ini fan name-nya Amano Jaku tuh apa? Nama no, 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 membership-nya? No, no, no. The, the, the club is called Bad Daddies. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go, Bad Daddies. <laughs> Throw a party for dead baddies. <laughs> throw a party for the bad daddies. Wait, I need to redo the. I'm pretty throw sure a... bad daddies would sell very well in the current internet culture. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, it's a K-pop group. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> the bad daddies, the K-pop group. Oh my god. Anyway. meet and greet ya. What the heck? <laughs> What the hell? Let's go back to uh, the Dushio. <laughs> uh, Sio? Is is he dead? Is he alive? I think Sio is AFK. Okay, let me just. Did did he fall asleep? Uh... Yes. yes, doctor. Yes. <laughs> okay. See you here. Sorry. It's okay. Take your time. The music's back. Oh man. <laughs> I'm oh, sorry. Man. I was laying down. I had. I don't have. A, I have something It's... bad going on. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> Take your time. Following Yoshikawa Hikari, man too bad Kohan is not here. <laughs> mm. The four of you slowly reach this. Um, what is it? Just, just this uh, normal place in the middle of nowhere. It's um, it's uh, it's it's a field. But it, it looks like you know just this this um, grasslands and uh, some place uh, some some and some part of them are filled with um, flowers and all. In mm. the middle, there's this what it's called again, gazebo, patio, gazebo, actually, and it's it's a huge one, a, a wide one. And uh, there's this table in the middle. The three of you are led there by um, this nurse, only to meet two other beings there. Beings. Yes. Not exactly humans, but well, beings. Hmm. First of all, you see. Well, first of all, uh, the the nurse, of course, Yoshikawa Hikari is there. Hmm. The other one is this really, really huge cat, a black cat with two tails, with a pair of tails, oh. just move around. You don't exa- it's, it's, it's the first time you see this cat, but for Murata Keshi, hi. You recognize the the cat, but before... It was? But, but before this cat, you know, every, every time you, met, you, you meet this cat, it's, you know, his, his cat-sized. Not giant-sized, but you know that it's Kate Sith, the owner of, a, of Carbuncle. So there's the black cat meeting Black Panther. Huh? <laughs> What you say? No. <laughs> And then the other one is already sitting behind the table. The small table is a beautiful lady. She has um, this black hair that's long, almost reaching the floor. 
She's wearing this white dress that is just simple. <clears throat> and weirdly enough in this place that is not bright. Not exactly bright. It's like it's all it's it's like eternal sunset. She's wearing this huge this this really white what is it that 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 hat? That straw hat that that the hat that people wear in the summer. I don't know what oh, it's called. Okay. You see this lady. Okay. And Kate Seth, noticing that you reached that place, Murata Keshi, he said, Ah, finally you're here. Yeah, it took some time. Well. Oh. And you brought some friends with you, huh? You said I could bring a plus one. You brought three. The other one is not planned. I guess. And uh, he looks at you, Sai. And who hmm. are you? And who's the other one? Um... I'm Yukimura Sai, and she kind of like turns her body towards Kohane. Um, this is Ono Kohane, and that one, Satoru. Satoru, Tachibana Satoru. Tachibana. That Tachibana. Yeah. We'll have a seat, that four of you. Please. Welcome to the mm. Crimson Chamber. Sai so kind of looks at her friends first, at Keshi and Satoru, as if like gauging like should we sit. I guess you will be cool. It's, it's, it's a sign of a uh, hostility. I mean, hospitality. <laughs> hostility. Uh, no, it, it's 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 Taka who's uh, flinching. Not not Kesi. I'm sorry. <laughs> mm -hmm. Very, very well. And she takes the seat. Sure. I believe you already met. Nurse Yoshikawa. I'm Kate Sith. I'm sure at least some of you already heard of Carbuncle. And ma'am, if you would introduce yourself, he looks at um the other lady, she said. Hasumi. Both of you can just call me Hasumi. I kind of perks up at the name. This is so sad. Kohani is not here. <laughs> yep. Sai kind um, of well, perks you, up you at did. The name. You, you well, you heard the name. But you didn't know how how she looks. <laughs> but well, you heard the name Hasumi. Uh, so yeah, but but the, the name is the, it's the same name. But well, well, Hasumi is a is a common name anyway. So you're well, not exactly. She sure. she she hasn't. She Sai's not saying anything. She just kind of perks up, sure. but she says nothing. And. The cat just... We're still waiting for another one. Um... Another one? Another member of the Crimson Chamber. Um... If I may ask, um, Kate said, 
just exactly how much members do you have? Come to think of it, how many members do we have? Say it, say it, Hasumi. What do you mean you don't know how many members Crimson Chamber have? To be fair, Crimson Chamber is not exactly... Just... We don't, we don't exactly have the strictest rule of admission for new members. It's because everyone dies. Every so often. Well, um... Uh, what? Uh, pardon the question, but what exactly is the Crimson Chamber? What 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 is all of? Sai kind of gestures to you know her surrounding. Like, <laughs> what is all, all of all of this? <laughs> all of this. The nurse Yoshikawa was like, come to think of it. What exactly do we do? <laughs> the cat was like, "Not you too, ma'am." <laughs> that was a joke, Miss y Yukimura. Sorry, was it? Yes. We're just a group of Aramitama. If that you, if that's what you're asking. Ah. What we do is oh. we control the Mononoke's from going overboard. I from here. From Kisara. I see. <laughs> Can she just so... coughing from the smoke? <laughs> <laughs> is he is he smoking right now? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he is. definitely is. He's definitely smoking. Sai so kind of like waves waves the smoke away from <laughs> Keshi's cigarette and she's like um i i i suppose this would be like your headquarters then no not exactly as we said this is just a just a gazebo where we have our tea parties uh, oh um i i, I see and Sai kind of like ruminates her thoughts a little bit. You can see that she does that thing where her eyes are like a lizard's eye, you know, it just darts everywhere, you know, she's just like thinking, it's like, um... It's like, what's actually happening? Yeah, no, no like, one is just, no. No one knows. Um, <laughs> like, what, what, it actually, what, what actually is happening? I, I understand that um, you're, you said you were waiting for one more member to show, but if you... Um. Why? Why? She she looks at the nurse and just like um. Why did you bring us here? Kate Sith asked me to. Sai so Sai so looks at Kate Sith. <laughs> Kate. Uh. The 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 cat was like. Well, it will be a little bit weird for a cat to be. Picking up people from the station, wouldn't it be? Oh, oh, n no, n not at all. I mean, after uh, <laughs> she <laughs> she's trying not to offend him, so she's just like, it's just like, you know, like her her voice just goes quieter and quieter, just like, and then she just resigns to her fate and just sits and doesn't say anything. <laughs> Truth to be told, not even this two are part of the Crimson Chamber. Not yet, at least. As you look at Yoshikawa Hikari, well, I'm still a human being after all. What? But I thought you said you were... So you're not an Aramitama. 
हंसू में से शी इज नॉट आई एम ओह एम आई आई आर आई आई डोंट <laughs> she kind of she kind of you know at this point she just she just looks at Keshi and Satoru for help just like <laughs> Satoru just shrugs he's he's gone <laughs> like he's confused <laughs> his his head is like you know like easy like the the whole thing that he went through like a few hours like probably not even an hour ago is just you know changed into this goofy ass group of people <laughs> he didn't even um, notice he that he's looking at you. <laughs> <laughs> And he's he's still smoking. Saya kind of waves the smoke away again. <laughs> it's like um um uh if if I may take away all the pleasant trees and just be direct here Kate said oh shit he took out the circus music <laughs> <laughs> exactly what do you want from us and she gestures to you know her party her satoru keshi kohane Kate just say said- You tell me. As far as I know, I only invited Mr. Murata Keshi to answer some of his question. And all the rest of you, the ones who board the train without knowing where you are going to. Right? And he looks at Tosh- Yoshikawa. As far as I know, I w- I was supposed to just pick up Mr. Murata, but What do you want me to do with the rest of people if I don't invite them to tea party? Isn't that quite, quite rude? To not bring them here. We have enough scones. I mean, I we could maybe l- leave if that would be You don't need to leave. It's all right. Kate says it's just a little bit crumpy. At this point, Sai, you know, she's like so overwhelmed from everything that's going on. You can you can see her sigh and she just like okay, and she literally just like melts into her chair, you know, just like slump, just like slump down, just like okay. <laughs> Hazumi then just say, "So, why are you here?" She asks you, Sai. Uh, she she immediately like per, uh, you know like <laughs> corrects her posture again. Oh, I I I meant to um I I I just meant to pick up someone because I heard that they were boarding the train to Kisaragi. Oh, who is it? Is it is it an Aramitama? A monon? Okay. A human mm-hmm. who can trap in mm-hmm. Sarai? Uh, n- no, and Sai just um, kind of looks at Satoru, you know, but also make sure that Hasumi sees her looking at Satoru. Uh, <laughs> oh, you found him already. So are you just going home after this? I. She <laughs> she looks at Satoru for help. <laughs> Again, Satoru is just confused. <laughs> <laughs> She's just like I I'm not quite sure. Hey, are the two of you? Yes. She squints and boy and girlfriend. Oh, no. No, no. No, I I no, no, no. No. Satoru just said Siblings Step siblings In a way S- Yes In a way e- Exactly I see That's boring I mean I've been here for a really long time I mean like 14 years So there's 
not a lot of interesting things around here. And look who I am actually hanging out with. A nurse and a cat. I... Uh, I'm sorry? Don't apologize. Um. And what about you? Um... Mr. Murata? That's what your name? I believe? That's yes. your name? Yes. You remind me of my husband. I mean, oh, my husband. Right. He oh, smokes a lot. Uh... Oh! Yeah, yeah. It, it, it tends to happen a lot, yeah. I don't think uh, that's good for your lungs. I mean, we have all... We all have our reasons. True. Well, true. true. But... I heard you're not here for... The tea party. I mean... I will never reject the tea invitations. Well, as far as I believe you... I heard from Suzu and, well... Puss in Boots here. Yes, it, Lord. That you are looking for answers about Amanujaku. Yeah, truthfully, that that dude's kind of annoying. Is he now? I think so. I mean, hey, people. Uh, modern days, people could have opinions. Is it modern days? I think so. There's yeah, yeah, it's, it's 2022. I already told yeah, you I that. Know, there's, like, you know, so <laughs> there's, idol, there's no idols in ancient times. I know, it's 2022. <laughs> he, he, she, she looks at you and... I really hate to say this, but I don't exactly like men who doesn't straight away say things it's hard to know what they're actually thinking if they keep going around and around and around the thing that they actually want to say is is, is that what happened to your late husband oh yes yes i think so be straight with it why are you here I think I, I think I I said it, dude. Hey, dude, I'm so... <laughs> <laughs> uh, I mean, I think I said it. I just want to know what's going on with Mr. Amano Jimmy. Uh, because, you know, I think Mr. Sith Lord right here uh, have, to have told you, I don't know if he told you or not, that I'm a man of business. I like my business seamless. As to the SOP goes. No dishes going on with the neighborhood and all. And since that Amano Jago guys keep coming. Even though yeah, sometimes he brings customers to the shops, the other shops. But I don't really like it, you know, his cheekiness and his shorts. I, I don't like people with shorts. I, I couldn't trust people with shorts. I'm sorry. I see. Oh. Before I answer, before any of us answer your question, what have been Amanajoko doing in that other world? Um, quite, there's been quite a lot of things that's been happening for the past, perhaps, week to week. And I feel that it, in each incident that we encounter, somehow, somehow, in some way, he's er correlated to it. There was that one time where 
a part of the city got overrun with a horde of mononokes and she you know she looks at uh, Keshi being reminded of Maria and everything hi <laughs> and uh, we also had to fight someone who supposedly were given power by Amano Jaku and that led to a lot of stuff but it, yeah it, it 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 was pretty messy um when the during the godwin pvp thing and you know the the amano jaku strain came and dropped clover did 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 i see amano jaku there So I feel like I only see Clover jumping down from the train. Well, let's Did roll an intellect check for recall. I'm dumb! <laughs> oh my god. Uh, intellect? Yes, intellect check for recall. Ah! Uh, pretty dumb. Uh, ooh, do you want to influence that? Um... Hmm... You know what? Why not change the? Can I change the one? Oh uh, sure, sure. I'll change the one to a three. Oh well, sure. Then I guess it's not the one. Uh, <laughs> so thirteen in total. Uh, you kind of remember vaguely that that's uh, that not not no, that's Morius. Amano Jaco is there. That's Morius. Hmm. No, no, that's Morius. Definitely not that's Morius. <laughs> I'm <laughs> um, And uh, er earlier today, there was a Kamigakari altercation that happened where I work. And, uh, well, surely enough, um, Manojaku was there as well. Working with Kamigakari? Yes. Huh. Okay, so you thought it was like... He... He turned a lot of Kamigakaris into Aramitama and... Not exactly a good thing to be happening, really. Oh, he can do that. He, he turned you... Right, he did. He turned... Oh. Doesn't matter anyway. So Amanajuku has been doing shit in the other world. That's reassuring. He's still himself. No, that's not reassuring. He's messing with the angel. We the angel. Do you, when you mean angel, do you, do you mean Hoshino Sera? Hoshino? That's her last name? Um, you mean, he, he, yes. Hoshino, the Hoshino couple who owns the restaurant? Yes, that very exact Hoshino. Sarah is adopted by the Hoshino couple. Isn't yes. she supposed to be in an orphanage? What didn't you tell me, Kate? Yes. The cat was like, I thought you know. How, the, how old I know? The orphanage is where I work. That's how I know about this. Yes, and... And she's... she's not... there anymore? No, she was adopted by the Hoshino couple a while back. Is... is something amiss? That child isn't supposed to be... 
with a human couple. What? It's... You know that it's too dangerous, Kate Seth. Look. None of us can stop Asmodeus. No. None of us can stop Amanuja. Stop saying Asmodeus. <laughs> bro, come on, bro. I was like, who the fuck is Asmodeus anyway? <laughs> I couldn't stop Asmodeus. Well, I know someone is ass. called Asmodeus, but this, that's the problem here. <laughs> what the uh, fuck? I love someone named Asmodeus. Kate Seth be like... You don't know, none of us can stop a man Jaku. You can at least tell me where my child is going. What? No. Anyway. The last time you did anything, well, Amanazaku did anything that involved any of you, is the angel, is this Hoshinosera, um, involved in anything? She was pretty much involved in everything. From the very first incident that we stumbled upon, I feel like even into the recent one, she was either there or people would mention her as the angel. We try our best to, well, I, I try my best to keep her safe, but Sera is, well, Awakened. E, I suppose, yes. Okay, and then she she looks a little bit panic in, in panic, and she she asks, "What about the, the other two girls?" Um, I, I I forgot their. Well, one is definitely my. Well, my. I gave her the name Frederick. Do you know oh. any Frederick? Yes, um, I suppose by two girls you mean Miss Frederick Hexenmeister and Miss Sayo Kurako? The other name doesn't sound familiar, but Sayo... Is she Professor Sayo's daughter? Oh, I'm not quite sure. I haven't had the... Um, I haven't had the opportunity to talk a lot with her, but I do remember the both of them mentioning that they are friends of Sera. And they're also so involved I in this. No, as... <sighs> yes. Amano Joko brought them all into this, didn't he? I, I'm not quite sure if it was Amano Jaku who did it, but every time we had to fight or there has been any incident involving Sarah, yes, those two girls would be there. Sometimes they would fight alongside us. At this point, the two of you can feel just this rift opening not that far from your um, left. Hmm. And emerge from this portal is a lady. Someone that you recognize, Murata Kenshi, of course. Oh no. It's the headmaster <laughs> of Fleur de Lune. The Soba Hater. <laughs> so, bringing with her, walking with her, um, are two other girls. That is, well, if she's listening, she definitely knows that it is her turn now to show up. Hey. It's Sayo Kurako, <laughs> and the other one is Frederick Huxenmeister. What the minute? What about the Seraton? <laughs> 
and um, being princess carried by Komore Bisuzu as Hoshino Sera. Ah. <laughs> Suzu just said, I see that everyone is here. Sai kind of stands up immediately and just like, Kurako, uh, Frederick. Uh, uh, hello? L long time no see, I guess. She kind of approaches. Uh, um, she 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 approaches Suzu first, who's carrying Sarah, and just like is she. She's alive. <sighs> For now. Thank God. I'm sorry, but but what is this place? Uh, where are we? Kurako is still holding Fred's hand, but of course. she's she's like hiding behind Fred. <laughs> hmm. Um. Sai then approaches Fred, and I guess also Kurako, who's hiding behind her, <laughs> and <laughs> she she kind of like puts Crack. she 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 puts like she like gently puts one hand on. Fred's shoulder and the other kind of reaching over to Kurako and it's just like it's a, a bit complicated for me as well but we're safe I suppose for now I'm I'm glad to see that you two are okay as well uh, well if, if everybody is okay then that that's good um, but as uh, Serata has been have been sleeping for a while now. Can we? Uh, can anybody wake her up somehow? And uh, I don't know. Check check her health. Uh, Sai like looks over to Kate Sid because she's unsure of what to do. Kate Sid look at her. Why is it your first instinct is to look at the cat and not the nurse? <laughs> well, to be fair, you're the one who's been talking. N never mind. <laughs> and she, she, she. <laughs> and then, she, and then, and then, and then finally, she looks over to Hikari and she's like, <laughs> she goes and stop. She's like, I'll take care of her. She walked to um, Suzu and, you know, lift uh, Hoshino up and moved to the side, put her to the ground, and I'll take care of her for a bit here. Just wait. And then she starts to do things. Well, she's a nurse, but, but, but what she's doing right now is, um, is closer to magic than medical stuff. <laughs> Hmm. Damn it, so that nurse is just a costume. <laughs> nurse it's, it's, Halloween. it's Halloween. It's a Halloween again. costume. Sai um, keeps her gaze on, you know, Sera, but she slowly uh, returns to her seat. Mm hmm. And says nothing. She's still keeping an eye on what the nurse is doing. Sure. Hasumi uh, assessing the whole wow. thing. Go on, Kurako. No, it's just, it's crazy. I went to like a place with the dads and now I went to a place with the moms. With moms. <laughs> mm hmm. <laughs> when you realize it's just moms versus dads. <laughs> is Murata Keshi a mom? Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I, thought someone like called, one. I thought someone called me whore. Oh my mommy, sorry. That, that person was me. <laughs> yeah. You could just say my name. Why'd you say someone? <laughs> You're someone. And then the question is, are you? <laughs> he is. Anyway. So Go on, Kurako. Oh, I thought you were gonna say, what are you going to do? <laughs> <laughs> okay. <clears throat> well, 
well, seeing as they're in uh, safer hands, although, of course, Kuraku doesn't know anything about the people here except for, well, the people she was... Uh, Suzu and the... yeah, but... Basically, she's she's still observing like a like a frightened little kitty, but she kind of believe Kishi and Sae and Kohane in a way that she saw them before and she knew that they meant no harm to anybody so far. Mm -hmm. And she does remember seeing them from above the train and with um, you know, with Clover. Going on them and killing a man of her. Okay. Technically, she saw everything. <laughs> so she approaches uh, Sai and, and Keshi. Keshi, are you there? Yes. Yeah, she approaches Sai and Keshi, and like, while still fidgeting a little, she's like, um, I, I assume you guys have, um, unanswered questions and stuff so i'm uh, i think i can answer some uh well she sai just like shares a glance with keshi you know just a bit unsure uh well i know i do but more importantly before that are are you okay are you tired or hurt do you do you want to sit down? Do you want to lay down? And Sai, Sai kind of like offers up her seat, you know? Uh, Kuroko instantly likes, oh, making a, a big cross with her hands and going like, no, 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 I'm, I'm, I'm fine, really, I'm not hurt at all. I'm more like, I feel like for, for now, um, you know, the, those people, they, they, they can't really harm us yet, yet, yet. Um, so I... I'm, I'm fine, I'm not tired or anything. Um, how, how about, how about you, miss and... Mister, uh, are you are you okay? I I can um I'm not as good as Miss Nurse over there probably, but I I can heal some wounds too. Um, Sai gives her like probably one of the gentlest smiles you've ever seen her make. You've loved and... it. Here. <laughs> Here's another <laughs> And she just says like. I am quite fine, Miss Sayo, but it's sweet of you to offer. I'll keep that in mind. As for Mr. Murata-san? Yes? Why is your HP 49 out of 50? Don't blame my healing, dude. <laughs> so there, you there you go. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, Murata-san, forgive me. I got so caught up with everything. I I haven't even asked. How are you holding up? <laughs> oh, uh, I'm doing good. Yes, thank you for asking. Uh, aside from my ever going to uh, decomposing lungs, yes. Wow, wow, you oh somebody must have said something to you for you to say that. <laughs> That's pretty interesting, lol. Uh, nah. I mean, lifestyle, isn't it? Wait, wait, is, 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 is Keshi still smoking? I'm sure he is. <laughs> yes. He, he's quite no. literally has a cigarette <laughs> on his arm. And Sai, Sai, Sai <laughs> just like stares at him and she's like, Murata-san, <laughs> um, we have children, minors here. Oh, I'm sorry about that. <laughs> And Sai is like he's he's coughing and all Sai does is lean over and plucks the cigarette from his finger. <laughs> uh, don't, don't worry. I mean, um, I'm kind of used to it, I guess. Uh, every time I see um, Mr. Murata over here, I always see him smoking in his shop too. So I'm kind of not surprised and not really faced. That's that's oh, okay. I. I I was more concerned about you know you inhaling the smoke more than Murata San's image. I don't mean that in a bad way, Murata San. I just mean well, you know what I Yes. Uh-huh. Right. Right. Please stop staring at me. I don't. Okay. Your principal uh, you know, it's not your principal. Kurako's principal would be mad at me. But um 
I, I like the moment you say that, all of you are, <laughs> you all all of you see like you know Suzu trying to uh what is it light up her cigarette and she just look at all of you. Hmm? Yeah, <laughs> Miss Komodo. Okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, ma'am. Everything's under control. Uh, sure. Sai just sighs, exasperated, you know. But she still, she still flings Cashy's cigarette somewhere else. <laughs> She's like, well, I guess that was... I made an effort at least. But yes, um, Sayo-san, regarding questions, well, I'm just mostly interested in what happened. How did you get here and were you... Who were you with before you came here? Um, well, I was... I was... Uh, sorry? <laughs> is that you or is that Kashi? It must be all the smokes. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. Uh, I was... Um, please, please sit down, Mr. Murata, if you, if you need to. I'm fine. Um, I was... I was with Amano Jaku and then this this man who is he the, the big man that smokes and um, the one that goes down to to all of you in the middle of the ride and one Amadeus. more guy with bandages and a sword I forgot their names I'm sorry oh, I wasn't really I focused do specifically do not like the bandage one Yep. At the at the mention of a guy with bandages and sword, Sai just like makes a look to Satoru. Oh, Satoru is listening mm-hmm. closely. <laughs> I, I see. Did they do anything to you, or asked you to do anything? No, I mean they kind of did. Um, just, just, just so that all of you know, I'm, I don't know anything about them. I'm just, I was in school with Seracha and, and then suddenly, um, suddenly, uh, I was ambushed at the rooftop. It was supposed to be, I was supposed to meet, um, head, the headmistress over there, but then when I went to the roof, uh, it was them, and then I was taken to, and then Sera was Seracha and, Serachan oh. was um was she fainted and well Serachan is the the angel and um I don't know how to explain this I'm sorry I wasn't oh, really okay, focused. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. But um, you, you you say that you're going to m- miss headmistress, right? Yes. Um. I mean the the school announcement said that Miss Komorebi called me to the rooftop and. Okay. Not her. So, uh, so with that, with that in mind, and you definitely didn't meet her. Can we? Can 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 can, can we call her here just to ask just a few things? Suzu. Yes. I mean, uh, oh, Kura, I, uh, I, Kura-san I... is like definitely going to go, getting announcement to go there. Uh, yes, but, but I, I think yeah. that's just. I think I think that was just Amano Jaku's trap. Um, Miss. Ah. Miss Komorebi is actually the one who saved me from from th- that that place. Oh, isn't that I... nice? Sai looks at Suzu just like I I see. Um I, I really don't understand what's happening, but I'm pretty sure those men or those men in the train that they're not up to anything good and they're pretty scary honestly i don't i don't think i couldn't even run away because i know i I wouldn't be able to and it was pretty scary but thankfully everything's fine and oh well um furechan is uh, i mean fred wasn't with her at the start Mm -hmm. but she's not also willing to spill all the details about the Mm -hmm. hex and meister so Mm -hmm. she kind of winces a little bit and goes like well, F- Furechan was kind of with me, I guess. I see. Oh, 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 wait, 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 wait. Before everyone continues. Yes. Uh, Kurakosta, Kimura-san. Please wait a bit. Wait a bit. Uh? Wait a second. Eh? Eh? 
What is it, Murata-san? She's trying to get something. <laughs> I know. <laughs> it's getting something. <laughs> He's getting something somewhere. He's doing his. He's Let doing the Rajiman. Let him cook. <laughs> he's doing the Rajiman thing. Let him cook. Okay, <laughs> go on. Oh, what did you do? <laughs> Let Rajiman go. He's he's take. He, he took the the, the flint trigger. <laughs> what? <laughs> what son? No, no, it's it's okay. Um, it's okay. Um, how how do I? Uh, how do I call you, Miss? She looks at Sai. Oh, uh, I'm. Uh, you can call me Sai. Oh, um, okay. It's okay, Miss Sai. I'm again. I don't mind. Um, I don't mind this smoke. It's just a little bit. My house is clean, so I think I'm. Ah. I'm okay. She. she but she pulls a thumbs up. But I, I. I was more concerned about. You know, I flung that to the ground. It's not. Exactly, clean. and you're going to put it into your mouth, okay? No, Hasumi no, Sanja okay. said, It's fine, his lung is dirty anyway. <laughs> right, um, but uh, rounding back up again, uh, Sayo san, um, was that all then? Did anything else happen? No, no, nothing else happened. Um, I think they were about to fight with um, with somebody I don't really know. I don't understand. But oh, um, that that um man, uh, who's his name again, Mister Godwin. He he was there too. I think he he was with Amano Jaku. What did he do? Well, he, he did nothing, but there were a lot of him. Uh, it, it's it's. I know this sounds crazy, but there were a, a lot of people that looked exactly like him, and I don't understand what happened. It was so freaky, but I think that might be human cloning experimentations because that's a, a, a lot of them which is being talked in the internet. Obviously, it's um conspiracy theory. But seeing what happened with, I'm sorry, I rambled, but. It's, it's fine. Uh, okay. It's fine. It's yeah. fine. Yeah. Uh, and then Casey just like try to whisper to uh, Sai, if you want to imagine there's like kind of that thing go went to your, you know, or organism. <laughs> and Sai, Sai, Sai just like melts into her chair again, and she, you know, she rubs her temples, just like. Why would you give me that image, Murata-san? Uh, this, this image is like a reminder of how we should be grateful with our current life. I... I suppose... Um, but I suppose that rounds it up then, uh, Sayo-san. Do you mind if I just call you Kurako? Uh, uh, yes, that, that, that would be fine, I guess. Okay. Um, thank you, then, Kurako. Um, is there anything else that we should know? Um, not, not really, but I do, I do have, I do have a request to make of everybody here, if, if you'd be willing to listen. Uh, uh, of course, what, what would it be? Please, he help me keep Serachan safe. Sai just steals a glance to again the nurse still working on Sarah, and your skull I... stands up. She's fine. She's just sleeping. She's under I'm gonna joke a spell, but I recover her from that curse, so that's fine. What I mean <sighs> is, it, it's not just what, what's happening to her right now, but I think, I think they're. They're after Serachan, the, the, the man, uh, the train, and I don't know what's going to happen to her if they ever got their hands on her, so I, I really, really need help. I don't think I can do this alone, and I feel like I'm, I'm not sure, but I think, I think you guys are 
Okay. She looks at Kishi and Sai and Guhani and like kind of tilts her head a little bit, biting her nails. I... Well, I do not speak for everybody here, but she she like looks into uh, Sarah again. But protecting her has always been one of my main goals, I suppose, aside from other stuffs. When you mention men, this you know men are after her. Does that include Godwin? I'm, I'm not sure. Um, I feel like Mr. Godwin was trying to protect both me and Serachan at one point, but that was also because Amanojaku was doing the same. So I'm not so sure. I just closes her eyes. Just, I, I see. And she opens them and just like scans the whole room, you know, making eye contact with everybody. So, what, what do we do now? What do we do? What do we do is the second question. The first question is what's actually happening, said Kate says. He looks at Suzu. Now my first question is that why is this girl not Angelica yet? What? It's Angelica's wish. It's beyond our control. And besides, that doesn't ruin the plan. Whatever you say, Komorebi. I'm sorry, wait, what what plan? Oh, am I part of something I don't know again? I'm no, so no, sick of it's... This. It's all right. Kurako, I made a promise with Angelica that I will protect you. Besides, it is also my job as a headmistress. I I see, but I think rather than being protected, I Kurako looks at Fred and then at Sarah. I I'd, I'd rather be protecting s somebody else right now. In any case, our problem... We have two problems. First of all, Amano Jaku, she looks at you, Murata. To answer your question, Murata-san. Amano Jaku is... Trying to bring Kisaraki back to the real world. Angelica is out of question, uh, out of his options since the start, but he still needs her power. She looks at Kurako, but I hope we can trust you now. I hope we can trust that Kurako will at least not give in to whatever Amanojako is trying to I, give her. I won't. Of course I won't. It's uh, the, he's he's scary. Okay, I, I can I know bad guys when I see them. It is scary, but he looks back to you again, Murata, and say, and she say, he's trying to use the angel's power to control the whole spiritual barrier in Sukimori. Basically, to turn everyone into awakened. Whether it's Mononoke what? or Kamigakari or Naramitaba. What? Why? Why would you want to do that? That's crazy. <laughs> wait, um, is, is that serious? Uh, wait, is, is that an actual goal? Is that even possible? Huh? If... That is possible if you have the power of the angel. It happened before with Angelica. But this time... The angel this time is far more powerful. Exactly. Thanks to the Exit Meister's project. 
she, she looks at Hasumi. <laughs> Hasumi. Hasumi say, I just wanted a child. I didn't know that she's trying to do that. Thanks, Hasumi. Thanks, Hasumi. I... I see. So on the where, other hand, where does that leave sorry. us? Oh no, she, she just asks, where does that leave us? Us, we are in the middle. In between... The Hexenmeister people and Amanojaku, because... Well... Truth to be told... Hexenmeister company is the one who created... Sarah. And through that process, created Frederick and Kurako. What? It's a long story. Oh, yeah. Cloning and whatnot. That. I... I see. The I... bureaucracy didn't, uh, didn't understand. <laughs> <laughs> so of course. I see. I'm... I'm... I'm sorry, this is just quite a lot to take in. <gasps> I know, right? Oh my god, everybody else was like, oh, I get it, but like, I didn't get it. But like, everybody was, oh, let's move on, but I did not move on. I did not get it. Saisa! I understand that it could be, that how confusing this is, I understand, but even I don't understand what. Hexen Meister angle here. She looks at Hasumi. My child, huh? Hasumi. Hasumi crossed her arms and. Victor wanted to create the perfect human. And I believe Alexander took on that project. He wanted to create an angel and put her under the control of Hexenmeister. So you're <sighs> saying that he's trying to control all Mononoke and Aramitama in the world through the power of an angel? More or less. So it looks some sort like of a. Uh... Like, makes everything into one instrumentality. But that would mean chaos. That That is considering even if you can truly control Aramitamas and Mononokes, but... If, if everybody is unawakened, then... In some wicked way, then nobody truly is. Um, I, I don't think, um, I don't think Mr. Amonojaku cares about chaos and peace. I think <sighs> he, he just wants the, his weird form of equality and justice. I see. Okay. So, if I could draw a conclusion you're saying that Amanojaku wants to make everybody an awakened and in some ways so do the Hexenmeister the Hexenmeister is offline <laughs> sadly <laughs> she can't comment on this I'm sure he has very juicy yeah. juicy infos but <laughs> True. Let her l let her let her ponder then. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay, Kurako uh, Sometimes, the, uh, sometimes it's uh, it's always we don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Where have I heard that before? I don't know. Some God, I hate right? the guy sometimes. 
I feel like I heard that. Did you hear that? Or something. <laughs> did you hear that? I, I feel like I heard something. <laughs> oh, my ears, my ear, my ears are kind of tickly. <laughs> did you hear I feel that? Like I heard I'm I sorry. Didn't hear anything. Let, let me scratch it for you. Okay, I come here. Let me scratch my ear. Oh, you. Oh my God! Look, 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 look! What I scratched from your ear. What did you it's scratch from my ear? It's, it's the sentence we don't know. <laughs> How did it get there? I don't know. <laughs> uh, we don't. What is it? Um, Suzu then just said, "Whatever it is, no matter how complicated this is, it's just our mission. Just one thing: to protect all these three girls." Yes. Save the idol, save the world. I can get on board with that. Uh, I'm really, really much more worried about Furechan and Serachan, but yes, we 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 need to p protect Serachan. Uh, I think Furechan is plenty strong, to be honest. I... Hmm. She does look stronger than one would assume but miss headmistress she looks at uh, suzu again but uh, where do we go from here does this mean that these three girls can't go back to their homes what? or that we can't go back to our homes What I mean is that, what do we do next? There's still something that we need to take care of here. Oh. That would be? That would be... Well... No. It is something that I need to do. For now, I need all of you to stay here for a while. I'll take care of things in the other world, and once everything is safe, then I'll open a portal there. But, but For now, getting the train, going through the station is... is dangerous because, well... I wanna joke because people will be... Hmm. You know. But miss, I... I need to see my parents. I... I need them to... Tell me everything by their own. I, I don't want to. I don't want to know all these stories from other people. I want them to tell me. And if I could, if I could, um, can I? Can I go home to my dad? She looks at there. Sayo. Kurako. Trust me. After this, in no time, you will be able to come back home to your parents. It is my job uh, as a teacher. Wow, that's a heavy promise. Anyways. Kurako <laughs> mm, uh, furrows her furrowed her brows in doubt and of course worry fear but i guess she has no choice but to trust the headmistress and everybody here for now knowing well knowing those so scary men are after her and her friends so she's just she just drops her head down and nod uh, weakly uh, Sai kind of gently pats Kurako's hand as, you know, form of sympathy. And then she turns to Suzu again. Uh, Miss Komorebi, was it? You can could call me Suzu. You... Ah, well, Miss Suzu, could you also perhaps uh, help me settle things in the orphanage? I'm pretty sure people there will be wondering if I'm, you know, missing. Sure, of course. Thank you. 
<laughs> then I need all of you to take some rest here. And wait for me to come back. She looks at Hasumi. Hasumi. Protect everyone. Including your own child. No, especially your own child. Hasumi. That is the plan. Sure. And stay safe, everyone. Thank you. You too. Uh, Miss Komore, be, be, be careful, please. You stay too. Safe. Stay safe, can, stay creative. Uh, stay safe and can I have the soul boy if you can return here? Hmm? Uh, wait, I forgot like how, how close uh, Kashi is with... Uh, oh, wait, you did Soba? Yeah. Why <laughs> did she say it? That will be my treat, Murata-san. Oh, oh, uh, uh, good, good to hear. Uh, and then Murata, Kesi has this monologue inside <laughs> of the, uh, his head, like, that doesn't sound good. <laughs> <laughs> she, I feel, I, I have a bad feeling. She, she then walks away and, Kate says, I need your help. Come with me. You know, I am older than you. <laughs> he walks with her, <laughs> and like the two of them are gone. Both of them disappear, and... If you imagine a movie... Hmm. The camera just slowly pans away to a nearby hill. Huh. And on top of that hill are three old men standing. <laughs> <sighs> <laughs> you mean the dead beats. Bad daddy. <laughs> Are you here for the girl again? Tachibana, I'm here Tachibana, to become Tachibana bad Guru man. have like his his sword. Uh you know, he's he's holding his sword like as if like he's holding it as if like he's holding a cane. Well, we found them. It was actually closer than I expected. Kisara is not that big of a place after all. <laughs> uh, and I see those two are here. You see, Mr. Rennie, I think your name is. Godwin, please. Godwin, yes. You can kill anyone you want. Just make sure that the girls are alive. Those three small ones. He, he meant uh, the high schoolers. Yeah, the high schoolers, yeah, yeah. <laughs> You are free to fight whoever you want to fight, but make sure... That... that kid with the blue hair... <laughs> make sure that one fights me. Do not touch my prey. Which blue <laughs> hair? <laughs> no, I think he's talking about Sire, bro. You oh, wait, Sire? Oh, right. I forgot. You guys, <laughs> I forgot. Both of them have blue hair. Yeah, they're, they're yeah, both I know, right? blue hair, so I'm kind of confused. One? I know. But, but then again, like, the one of them have his hand missing, so, like, he handed to him. <laughs> uh, so, yeah. Oh, you mean the male one or the female one? <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to hear it from here. Well, both, of course. Oh, great. Well, if you say so. But there's one thing that I need you to help me with. Go oh, on. Oh, come on. Mr. Godwin. 
so there's this thing that keeps on bothering me every time I try to do my stuff. Well, what's your name again, uh, Mister with the green coat? <laughs> he's, uh, you you're looking at him, but he's he's not focusing at all. He's just staring at that area, and Goro just said, "You are awfully quiet today, Orochi." Let's get this over with. Well, just take care of your own men or woman, should I say? <laughs> what were you going to tell me, Godwin? Oh, nothing. I just wanted to know if you have the wits to actually crush under the head of one of yours. I don't care that much about Satoru. You can kill him if you want. What about the other one? What's what's her name? Ono uh. Kohane. She knows her place. She won't be a nuisance, dare I say. Good. That's all I need to hear. Through your conversation, you can you can see like his he his he's not focusing at all. He he noticed that uh, that he was not as talkative as the moment he first met him like mm -hmm. the, the the first first yeah 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 yeah, yeah. that one so the powerful the powerful ones are all gone so we got them then Ah, uh, well, let them have just a little bit of false sense of security. <laughs> that will make the hunt more fun. Oh, you are fun. I like that. <laughs> Mr. Godwin. Hmm? Just make sure that you are strong enough to fight alongside us. You're saying that I'm a deadweight? Yes, for now. Godwin clenches his tooth, but but tries his best not to glare at the two. He's just like staring into his target house. He <laughs> clenches his butt. Uh, You know, you don't really have to think about me at all. I mean, we all have our own objectives, and you just need to focus on that. Just make sure you're not a little bit too... What's it called? Mm, too focused on your family problems. <laughs> I do not have my family problem, Mr. Godwin. My family is the problem. Whoa! <laughs> Gaslight Master right Fuck here! You <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you too! Fuck you too, old man! So... 
say uh what's your name orochi don't call me orochi well you haven't really introduced yourself yet that will uh, be enough Amadeus, a uh, Mr. Amadeus, right? You don't look too hot. Are you sure you're suitable for this job? <laughs> I killed my own man. I've worked for me for a really long time. Is that regret? You're not I one sense. to question my resolve. Uh, Godwin, Godwin, like feel this like uh, shiver in his spine. Not because he's afraid, mm -hmm. but because he's excited. <laughs> like, oh, someone. Oh my God, he's no, 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 <laughs> it's not that way. turned on. <laughs> it's 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 because it's because like most people in his life, it's always like it's always like have this small resolve. Oh, uh, of course. <laughs> so like uh, the moment like he feel like oh yes this this guy I can vibe with this is my man or something. Like that. <laughs> can you stop? Not that way. <laughs> you're not beating. Not you're, that not way. you're not you're not, yeah. you're not you're not you're not helping yourself. You're not making it better. <laughs> I'm so funny. Making myself look like that. Oh them. my god, God, this is uh, a bad let, let daddy. Me put it. Oh my god, this is my broski, <laughs> my bestie. When you said when you said Godwin could harden, I didn't mean you meant it that way. Oh god. <laughs> Naur, such an icon. No, your 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 Naur will not save you now. Oh my God! But my bestie, got my bestie, the, got the bad paid. daddy. Oh my God! So we wait for tonight. Is that what we do? No, oh, well. <laughs> Just wait a little bit more. Well, I guess I could wait for a little bit more. God, God when he walks towards like a pole and then like thrust his back mm -hmm. or something. Sure. It's the 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 it's like I'm I'm on your sit down on the on the ground, cross his legs and just close his eyes. You're not exactly sure what he's doing. Well, uh, as you also lean back and just wait for a bit. But out of like the three of you, you can see that. Goro is not moving anywhere, he's not sitting down, he's not lying down, he's not even leaning back to anything. He's just stand there, looking down on the prey in front of him, with ha both hands on the handle of his sword, smiling really widely, excited <laughs> for what's going to happen. He's holding his sword, excited. I know, right? <laughs> Before we end the session, <laughs> the next scene doesn't involve any players. Oh, damn. Oh, shit. Well, <laughs> you made it. Papa, what? Meanwhile, while that is happening in the Kisaragi Void, the scene opens in that very same lab. And 
and the second research facility of Hexenmeister Company. Alexander. Hexenmeister is standing there. As his arms crossed. Looking at the screen in the middle of that room. So what you say? Is that my sister? The one I raised. The one most resources went to. Treat me just like that. I I don't know what to say, sir. I mean, that that's what happened. I like I, sir. The plan was was perfect for us to attack and and for the mistress to help us. But this is something that allows that out of our region. I don't know what to say. You do not know what to say, huh? I say... I thought you will be different, Faust. But just like... The one your genetics is based on! You are... Incompetent! S sir I, I swear to you, it's... I, I can do better with more preparations. More preparations, you say? Elaborate. Ah, uh, I mean, sir. He stands up. Look at where we are! Look at... All of these specimens! Within all of these tanks that we... Worked on for years and years. I'm sure I can... Use at least most of them. As you can see, I am a perfect clone. And we all have the data of what that trash Dubois did to me. All I need is the help. from Professor Sayo. Fine. I'll give you another chance. Sayo! You heard all of this, right? Sayo walked. Sayo Shigeru walked too. Both of them. 
You... You want me to use all of this clones and... Help him fight. Amano Yaku. The disease. The power of Angelica and the new angel. And, and your, your own sister, sir. You don't need to repeat that to me. I know why I said what I said. I see. <laughs> <laughs> this, this is utter stupid. Well, I think I have, I have had enough, sir. And he raised his hand, holding a, a small box with a red button. So you, I cannot let you do any more harm. To my daughter and her friends. As in the middle of the research facility, Two of the Hex and Miser headquarters. One of the biggest explosion ever recorded in Sakimori history happened. And that is the end of our session. Fuck you, Hex and Miser! Let's go! Kurako, Papa! Kurako! I, I'm 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 sorry, Bapa Kurako, but I'm sorry, Bapa Kurako, but Kurako gone, Kurako gone, ah, ooh, Hexen Master gone. I'm 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 sorry for your loss, but fuck you, Hexen Master, fuck you. Anyway. Oh my God. Oh, what what about what about my children? Fuck your children. No. No. Not the the boys. Not the boys. Fuck, fuck you, Dubois, and fuck your du boys. <laughs> oh my oh. God. Anyway. Gila, game-nya parah banget nih. Eh. Anjay, rekam sendiri. Gila, <laughs> Avoid, ada yang avoid. Avoid, ada yang. yang... <laughs> Avoiding copyright. <laughs> <laughs> Smart. <laughs> oh my god. Jago jago jago. Jago jago jago. Enggak apa-apa Bang, suka 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 suka. Oh, uh, anyway guys. Rasanya kayak sure fall out gitu alive, rasanya. I'm, I'm yeah. pretty sure Alex is alive, but at least the first city is gone. What the fuck? Yeah, yeah, well, we'll see. <laughs> oh, oh shit. <laughs> oh lord. Anyway. Dia langsung the facility is just a construct. Thank you. Oh, the facility is just a construct. <laughs> It is the fa facility is a construct. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Yeah, uh, what is it? Uh, thank you guys for hmm? playing. <laughs> yeah. I don't know what will happen in the next session. <laughs> It's okay, Avan Luna. Mitochondria is the powerhouse of a cell. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> God damn mitochondrias. Uh, mitochondria? What's, what's with mitochondria? Uh, the power it's the powerhouse of the cell. <laughs> it's the powerhouse of the cell. I what, see. What is that? Power is, that a new, is that a new meme? Is that a new meta? No, that's just the no. powerhouse of the cell. <laughs> it's just the powerhouse of the cell. <laughs> it's just the powerhouse of the cell. Uh, it's can we talk about Lisosome in the next section instead? Instead of <laughs> Lisosome. Apa sih itu yang masak kok kan? Uh, Hah? Hah? Yang masak ya Power Hah? House of the Cell kan? Oh berarti benar ya. Berarti itu <laughs> dia udah masak juga dong. It's the Power House of the Cell. 
anyway. It's the power anyway. Hazard, so it can it can destroy <laughs> people uh, like easily because it's the power hazard. Next. I did it. Next. I could I could time when he would say anyway. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> no, don't. <laughs> <laughs> How do you like that, <laughs> man? <laughs> How do you like that, from, uh, <laughs> Report reply from the virtual crime <laughs> scene. <laughs> Explosion happened. Uh, we'll see. Uh, yeah, next session is. Uh, well, it's scheduled to be next week, but we'll see if it's going mm. to be next week because I don't know. I I don't think next week will be. <laughs> <laughs> I think the I, I think the next session will be hard. <laughs> yeah. Hey Keshi, is your shop open? <laughs> I might want to do a few things here. Keshi. So I, I'm Keshi. a little bit far away, but Keshi. <laughs> but shop I have open. I, I have I, I have the obligation for not sell my things to the other guy. <laughs> bang, buka tokonya bang. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> it's uh, killing me. Inside. God, I mean, yeah, it's it's. Oh God, who the fuck asked ask for PVP? I don't know, man. It wasn't <laughs> me. Who asked for it? Man, Kisa, the, the Kisa Nagi arc is hard. <laughs> it's 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 hard. Mm, but hey, at least like we have, at least we have the bad daddies. <laughs> the bad daddies who are also <laughs> hard. <laughs> they are excited. <laughs> The hard yeah, bad that, daddy. That's what they always say. Oh god. <laughs> and <laughs> thank you guys for coming to the session. Thank you, Lila Alstramaria. Uh who played uh, briefly today and um Ew, I'm on the side of them? <laughs> oh yeah. You have you have so, Rai Galilei you're on your part side. Of the bad daddies. Uh, yes, you're you're not, no, well, you will not Why aren't him. you part of the bad daddies, Murata No, he's not. He's with the mom. Shut up. If he's part of you, the bad you daddies, might, you he's might like say him. I, I enjoy playing with the cat. The nice mommy. Ima wow. Imagine imagine Murata Keshi being part of the bad daddies and with this, you know, granification and everything. Uh, that's, that's not true. That's too much. Yeah, that's, <laughs> that's, 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 that's the exact <laughs> reason why I'm not belong there. No, no, no. We've, we've claimed him. It's okay. Oh, There's God. already enough OP people over there. We just oh, need some personal. Come here. OP people at another one for Cliff. Use, uh, use all of the three of them. <laughs> Uh, oh, is it some, something shining? It's Goro. Attack him, attack him. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you again for uh, everyone who attended this session. Also, Lila. Also, um, also our prayers go to, um, you know, Narahara Maung. Yeah. Here's hoping that she can attend the next session. I deliver the prayers to her room. Yes. Yeah. Are you just going um, to knock, 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 Morse code? Prayers. <laughs> Opens door, starts praying. <laughs> I'll send prayers for you. <laughs> I'll send prayers for, for you. Nara, Nara, Mau. Don't forget to don't forget to subscribe to these amazing regulars, man. Something. Man, the occult club, the occult club moment in this session is fun. I know. Oh, occult club. It's not oh, about the the, 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 the the POV lo mainan orang kaya. Yeah, bener itu sumpah itu dimainin sanjir eh, aku kuraku dimainin like sama friend. <laughs> kuraku kenapa? Kuraku dimainin sama friend mulu anjir. Siapa sih yang gak mau? Makanya, makanya tadi gue bilang kan PLV lo mainan anak orang kaya gitu. Siapa sih yang gak mau? So is it Fred X Kuraku or is it Kuraku X Fred? Wait, bedanya apa? Oh, who's the same here? Obviously Fred. Kuraku is like a pet. Really, I would, I really, I would love, I, I would love to see Kuraku ini. Maybe in future sessions yeah. after you know, I think she was gonna snap once again after if she oh, hears damn. the news about her dad. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's <laughs> not gonna. Ooh. So many, so many things. So many.
but 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 uh, what, hey, what that's about the curse what of about the main character? <laughs> what about oh, shit, Hex and go. what about Hex and Meister uh, Hex and Meister X Atomic Bomb? <laughs> <laughs> I ship. It was Alex never mentioned dead. that it is. It was an atomic bomb. <laughs> Yeah, how about like, how about you and your gang uh, X being a bad father? Ooh. <laughs> 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 Shut up, you're not control. So do you feel lonely right now, Ryan? Oh, for the like, the baddie is alone. Really? Uh, like with that many clones? What? I I wonder why he still feel lonely at night. I know. <laughs> Imagine the possibilities. Because no, it, do not it, imagine the possibility. No, I'm imagining. I'm boring. imagining the possibility. You don't control me. <laughs> oh God damn. Uh, you don't control me. Anyway, yeah, oh, Godwin, go fuck yourself. <laughs> <laughs> so that's why he doesn't want to be controlled. He controls himself. <laughs> no way. I'm waiting yeah. for more Godwin lines to pop off. <laughs> But Godwin's lines, you'll love to hear it. <laughs> Shut up, you don't control me. <laughs> you do not control me. Oh, that's why he, that's why he said he uh, don't uh, you don't control me because he 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 control himself. Oh. <laughs> what? Oh. Oh, a lot of them. Oh. Hey, he's a model oh, citizen. He has a good self control. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Uh, I guess she acts principle. <laughs> Just saw that. Pretty, yes, pretty cute. 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 No, cute. No, no, no. Wait, no, no. no. That couple will just have really, really bad lungs. <laughs> <laughs> That's why. <laughs> just admit it. You guys Please ship stay them together. Yeah, they, they only. You guys only ship them because they both smoke. <laughs> yeah. Please stay together. <laughs> hey, I guess they are all smoking hot. <laughs> That's true. Uh -huh. That's true. Yeah, that's true. Uh, you know what else yeah, hot? Yeah, lungs. Yeah, sure. You know what else hot? Their lungs. And you know what else also hot? My lungs right now. <laughs> Stop oh, smoking, no. Regiment. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, you don't even smoke. <laughs> I don't smoke. That's the it's funniest thing. No, no, it's been burning for like this past few hours. An eternal flame. Anyway, okay, okay, okay. Because Regiment is at his limit. Uh, let's uh, stop Ooh. this uh, stream right now. Don't forget to um, subscribe to these people: Zia, Cornelia, Hiona, Tiara, uh, Murata Keshi, and uh, Gatwin. Um, also, Nara Haramaung and Laila Stremeria. And see you guys later on the next session of Nocturne of the Heaven. Oh, yes, we're gonna say, Oscar Eja! Oscar Eja!